We'll see. I'm very scared. Okay, we're gonna start. Tiny butterfly flapping its wings today may lead to a devastating hurricane. Tomorrow? I don't know what that said. I'm so scared. The smallest decision can dramatically change the future. Oh no. Your actions will shape how your story unfolds. Please. So this is like um, Detroit become human, basically. Your story is one of many possibilities. I just hope I don't kill anyone instantly. Choose your ex actions carefully. I'll I'll try. I'm already getting chills, like I'm already scared. Uh, you wonder if it'll show the paths like in Detroit? I don't think so. My heart is already pounding, oh god. Also, let me know if it's loud, because I can still adjust the audio. Or not loud enough, I guess. Deserves it. It is not her fault that she has a huge crush on me. Hannah's been making the moves on him. I'm just looking out for my girl, Em. <sighs> just because he's class pres doesn't mean he belongs to everyone. Mike is my man. Hey, Em. I'm not anybody's man. <laughs> Whatever you say, darling. I'm scared. What is that emo, Justin? This is going to be super rude of them. Yeah, I hey, think so. Did you see that? Dad said it'd just be us this weekend. Josh. Send help. Oh, is this me? Oh, I think this is me. Oh, shit. No, please. I'm not ready. <laughs> Already terrified. Okay, can I move the camera? Not really. Just a little bit. Okay. What was that sound? Oh god. Oh, is that someone sleeping? Alright. I'm already so on edge! Please! <laughs> Literally the tutorial popping up startled me. I didn't read that. Oh shit. Shit. Press and hold R2 to pick up the bottle. Hold R2. Okay. Oh, I see. What? Hello? Oh, okay. I Literally, the sleeping people are fucking scaring me. Okay, what? what do you want me to do? What do you want me to do with this? Okay. Jeez, Josh. <laughs> Once again, brother, you've outdone us all. Um. Okay. Was there something shiny here? Yeah. I am scared. Hannah. Oh god, you look so damn hot in that shirt, but I bet you're even better out of it. Come to the guest 
room at 2 a.m. mic. Oh my god. What did our naive sister get herself into now? Oh no. I got your note. I'm glad you can make it. I'm so on edge. Please. Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out and see where it goes. What kind of move is that, Mike? Oh, hell yeah. He's loving this a little bit too much. Oh my god. She's taking her shirt off. What? Oh my god. Matt, what are you doing here? Uh, Hannah. I'm sorry, Hannah. Hannah. Hey. This all got out of Just but... a stupid prank. Uh, Jerks. They are. She's got a butterfly yeah. tattoo. Yeah. They really focus on that. I feel like that's going to be important, maybe. Oh, no. She left. No. You, no, 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 no. Oh, no. My first choice. Awake, Josh? Josh. I don't know. Josh. Fuck. Fuck. No. There's someone outside. Oh, no. Hannah! <clears throat> What's going on? Where's my sister going? <sighs> it's fine. She just can't take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. Oh, not that. What did you do? We just messed around, Dad. It wasn't serious. You jerks! May also Hannah! just be a reference to the butterfly Hannah! effect. True. So, should we go after her? You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike. No. Oh, shit. Fuck. 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 I fuck. Safe. Safe. Oh, maybe I should have gone fast. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Uh, follow footprints? I don't know. Oh, shit. Apparently they're scared of her. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Jesus! Fuck! Shit! Damn it, Hannah! Where are you? I'm scared. I noticed there also wasn't a difficulty setting, so I use a touchpad as shown. Hannah! This is really confusing, using both sticks at the same time, like, please. Hello? Oh, that's how it works. Okay. Jesus! Hold L1 to walk faster. Uh, I don't really know how this works. I lied. Hello? This is a lot of things at once, Beth. I'm holding a lot of buttons at once. Oh. Oh no, a shoe. Oh, for feck's sake. That is not a shoe. Okay. You might also have to look. No worries. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Leaving the game to full autonomy? Oh my god. Oh, I might have to lurk. Oh, right. <laughs> yes. Hello? There was a thing. There was a thing. I missed a prompt. I'm pushing a lot. Listen! It's the left stick, the right stick, the left button. It's a lot, okay? It's a lot. 
off. Back and back and shit. How does this work? How do I move the light? It's not very intuitive. Hello. Okay. Hello? In horror movies, they tell you not to go out in the dark. I didn't have a choice. She Anna. went here of her own accord. Anna. Oh, God. Anna. Oh, my God, you must be freezing. Why would you do this? No. No. Fuck. No, 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 no. No! No shit. Oh feck. No. Hold on. I'm scared. What are these flames? Ah. Hannah! Surely I wasn't gonna drop Hannah! Oh my god. Oh no. Before we begin, there are a few things I need to make sure you understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. Oh my God, please. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. He's getting really close. So, you have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. Sometimes, sometimes these things can be a little scary, even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. I feel like everyone's gonna die. I'm All so right. sorry. We will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up the card? Oh no. At least you know I would have died with you. <laughs> Hannah was her sister. I think they were sisters. It is a sense yeah. that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. Oh, is it me? It's me. Why is this a gloved hand? Right. This, this reminds me of a Dead by Daylight map. So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. Frustrated because... Uneasy. Um, I mean, it, it doesn't make me happy, but none of these. Neither of these options. I guess the scarecrow is a little unsettling. Okay. Honestly, Maybe. It's good. What do you think it is that makes you feel uneasy? Hmm. 
Yeah, the scarecrow. What do I see? I see. I don't know what this is doing. The scarecrow were not there. Would you feel comfortable staying there on your own for a period of time? Say a week, for example. Mm, no. Mm -mm. Oh no? Why not? Elevating the personal scare. Oh fuck's sake! I'd be scared. Is there something else? Oh my future? god! Imagine Mel. Stop. No. The fields and just like how secluded it is. I don't know if that's gonna be an option though. So, but yeah. Yes, Mel. Definitely will be having heart palpitations. That's intriguing. But perhaps we can explore... Oh, no. The next time we meet, I'm afraid we're out of time for now. Why is this a gloved hand, though? Like the hand we saw. My hand, basically. Nothing's happening and I'm terrified. Might be the killer's POV. What killer? <laughs> what killer? This isn't Dead by Daylight. <laughs> Me- the killer. What do you mean? What killer though? Who killed who? Isn't there a killer? There was someone outside? Maybe? But technically no one was murdered. I let go. He was trying to help us. I'm like, what the fuck? I've seen this. I should know. But... The guy was trying to help us, I think? Like he was reaching out for them? I don't know. You need coffee for this? Yeah, same. I've got mine. <laughs> Not the dolls. Yeah, this is all very unsettling. The song. Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Annie Klein was in charge of the investigation. Thanks for having me, Marty. Listeners, an update on Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of Why does this sound like Robin from um, Stranger Things? Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interest in the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? Oh my god, not the sanatorium. The girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Thank you for joining us, Anthony. With all the Washingtons tonight, their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Of course there is an old sanatorium. Oh no. Let's do that again. Alright. Well, hello, friends and fans. You have a thought. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I Hello, Freddie say, Mercury. I'm super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. Ah! It's so, not us um, making the same you know, joke. Uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I What's know the thought? it's going to be tough on all of us going back after what happened. Last it's because we year, saw the movie recently. Or like I just want you all bits to know, of it. Um, it means it means so much to me that we're doing this, and that I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're we're all still here together, and I'm thinking of them. 
I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget. I don't want to kill any of these people, the please. You know. Okay, so... Oh, they're his sisters as well, let's okay. party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make oh, it's this. this. I was like, what is in the background? We'll forget, all right? <laughs> yes! The scenes with the analyst, maybe they are with the killer, assuming there is one. Yeah, I mean, maybe. Assuming there is one. Indeed. Maybe they take place in the old sanatorium back when it was still active. Oh, so you think they're flashbacks? Maybe. That would be interesting. I'm scared. I don't want to play. Why did I want to play this? Uh, the killer was a patient there and is now still roaming around the area. Maybe 10 hours until dawn. Well, maybe there is a killer. Oh my god, please don't die instantly. Hannah's best friend, diligent, considerate, adventurous. Oh my goodness. All right, here we go. Here we go. Please. Someone there? Not the Mori. This is Dead by Daylight. Please. I'm freaking terrified. I'm about to cry with how scared I am. Why did I think playing this was a good idea? Someone let me know. Oh, objects of glint can be inspected. Oh, what? The gate's busted. <sighs> Climb over? Not that. All right. Well, can I what can I go that way? No. Alar, climb up. Safe. I'm gonna keep you all safe. I don't want anyone to die. I almost missed it. Quick time. <gasps> I missed it. Climb, 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 climb. Is it Freddy Mercury or Freddy? Uh. Both seem right and wrong at the same time. I'm guessing- I think it's the first one? Oh my god, I can't really look at chat because I, I don't want to miss any of the quick time events, so I'm sorry if I'm a little less... ...interactive, I guess, with this game. I just- I don't want to miss quick time events and accidentally kill someone. I- oh, f fuck. No, 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 no. <laughs> Cutie. I'm gonna keep you all safe. Why does that remind you of that TikTok sound? I should add that just for this game. We're all gonna be safe, and we're all gonna have a good time. What in the Jesus Christ was that? The timing of that was impeccable, truly.
Indigenous people and butterfly prophecies. Tribes who once lived in these mountains believe that butterflies carry dreams and prophecies of possible futures. Oh no. The color of the butterfly indicated the nature of the prophecy. Black butterflies prophesied the dreamer's death. Red butterflies warned, warned of dangerous events. Brown butterflies foretold of tragedy affecting friends. Oh no. This is going to be significant in the game, I think. Yellow butterflies offered visions to help and guide. White butterflies brought dreams of luck and good fortune. Max's butterfly tattoo was black. Who's Max? It was foreshadowing all along. Her name was Beth. No, Hannah. Her name was Hannah. The sister was Beth. Oh, I can scroll, right? Uh, are we going to need to remember these colors? Beth and Hannah? Yeah. All I need to know is black is death. <laughs> You're not good with names? That's fine. Okay. And white is fortune. White butterflies brought dreams of luck and good fortune. Okay. Black is death, white is good, yellow is help. Okay. I'm so scared. R and R. As you explore, you can discover totem artifacts. Picking a totem up and turning it will reveal a colored butterfly and a premonition of a possible future. Yellow? Guidance totem. See, I miss this. Oh, we got one death totem. Possible death of the person who finds it. I do not want to complete the death totem poll. Uh, <laughs> let's just say that. I do not want to do that. Um, guidance. Okay, so that was like a bird flying away. Mystery man. Oh. Hi, cat. Welcome in. Popping in while you're waiting on your food to finish cooking. What are you having? I hope you're doing well. 1952, the twins. Okay, okay, okay. Interesting. Until Dawn is such an intense game. Yes, <laughs> definitely. I have watched a playthrough of it six or seven years ago now. So, you know, a while. It's been a while. I remember, like, main storyline things. No details, though, so... Um, and playing it yourself is definitely a whole new experience than just watching someone else play it. Oh! I wonder... These will probably change as I make choices. I wonder if the character traits change, though. I feel like they might, or they wouldn't show them like this. So, like, if I choose very safe options, bravery might go down... Um, if I lie, honest might go down and stuff like that. Okay, so this is very interesting because I don't know what this means. The twins. I, I guess we're going to find clues about their disappearance and death, maybe? I don't know what this means. 1952. What does this mean? <laughs> And then the mystery man. Is that going to be the guy that tried to help them? Or the guy we're seeing now? Because there is a guy creepily, like, following us. I'm going to... Oh! And driven man. Sorry, what? 
Oh, finding all the totems means... Completing that. Okay. Jesus, that was gory. Can we get an, ex an exclamation point TW? I'm in the chat again, because... Mikey Mikers, yes. <laughs> okay. Oh, wait. Inspect. Oh, I can't. I haven't unlocked any of these yet. Okay. I'm... I'm... <laughs> procrastinating in this menu oh no future is uncertain whether or not the prophecy comes true depends on the choices you make press r1 at any time to view your totem collection okay 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 you're so invested in your theory you don't even know if there's a killer oh yeah mr fia has a theory that the um, the conversations with the analysts we see are happening in the past. Because there is apparently an old sanatorium on this mountain as well. So he thinks that maybe it's someone in the sanatorium talking to the analyst. Um, and it's basically like flashbacks. The past is beyond our control. I want to find everything. Like, I want to unlock every single possibility to give me the best chance <laughs> of survival. Like, I don't want any of these characters to die. Please. Chris? You here? Alright, Chris left us a note. Clue oh, found wanted poster. Mystery man. Clue found. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, we don't know who the killer is. We don't even know if there is a killer. Uh, puts on tinfoil hat. 1952 is probably the year when the killer escaped from the sanatorium. We don't know if there is a killer. We're just assuming. <laughs> um... Torn up wanted poster about a fugitive on the mountain dated 1998. Someone didn't want people to see this. Oh, because they tore it up. Right. Milgram Victor. Last known address Blackwood Pines. Last seen 16th of March 1998. Wanted in connection with a first degree arson offense as well as various death threats. We did see flames. Um, when Hannah and Beth died, there were flames. There was, like, a flamethrower or, like, fire. I don't know. You connected the dots. You didn't connect shit. You won't spoil anything? Yes, thank you. <laughs> um, anyone with information regarding this dangerous criminal should contact the BPMC as soon as possible. July 1998. Okay. Interesting. Um, yeah, can we do an exclamation point safe word in the chat as well? Because I do want to avoid spoilers. I, even though I kind of know the story, I also don't want to spoil it for anyone watching for the first time. And I do talk to myself a lot as well, so. When I'm playing games like this. Click clues to solve the mysteries of Until Dawn and increase your chances of survival. No. Okay, okay. Just want to explore. This is fucking creepy. Huh. Okay, then. Wait, so there's a gun here? Oh my god, I, f I thought someone was going to like pop up in the background there. Okay, I think I've kind of explored everything here. I'm so scared of missing things. I think everyone's gonna die. I'm not gonna lie. I don't think... <laughs> I don't think anyone's gonna make it out alive because I am really bad at this kind of thing. I suck at quick time events and I suck at making the right choice. So... Teehee! 
Uh, all we know at this point is that there's a shadowy figure that scared the campers. You assumed he was out to kill them, but he did extend his hand to save them. Yeah, <laughs> he did. He tried to save Hannah and Beth, I think. I'm, I mean, he reached out to them. You're not in the bag, are you? Is he trying to scare her? No, this person has a mask on. Oh, no. She's very honest, though. I feel like she wouldn't snoop. Uh, did they take the hand? No, they didn't. Um, I chose not to. Because the choice was take the hand or drop Hannah. And I didn't want to drop Hannah. No, it was like, let go or drop Hannah. Chris? Sam, hey, hey. I don't know. Chris has a crush on Ashley. Methodical, protective, humorous. Okay. Oh, so butterfly effect update. Kind of amazing. What? I'm not gonna tell you. You gotta see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? Right around here. It's gonna blow your mind. Status update. What do you mean? Follow Chris. Okay, okay. So yeah, I didn't want to do that, but then they did both die, so... I could have saved maybe one of them. <laughs> the good thing about these kinds of games, though, is that you can play it multiple times and choose different things. So next time I play, I might choose to drop Hannah and see what happens then. They both died, yes. They both just dropped to their death, basically. Have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. The intentions were good, yeah. <laughs> Alright. Here goes. Oh, do I have to aim Bessie's? Mm, Bessie's, I know. Oh, and there's like a timer. There's timers on the shooting? Luckily, they're slow. Jesus. Oh my god, you all know I suck at aiming. Please. Especially with a controller. Wow, nice shooting tips. All right. Go ahead oh my god. My heart is pounding. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Don't shoot the squirrel, Jesus. You're gonna spend time with the hubby? Have fun and try not to be too scared. I'll try. Enjoy your quality time. Oh, thank you for dropping in. Enjoy your dinner as well. Your ass just got sacked. <sighs> hey, sharpshooter, a ride's coming. Wait, I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on. Wait, Chris, that did something. Hard. Okay, so not choosing to shoot the squirrel did something. Butterfly effect update. Okay, so now we're Chris. Oh, inspect. Sam respected Chris's privacy. Chris was happy to see Sam. Okay. Chris chose not to shoot the squirrel. Nature remained in balance. Okay. I'm scared. What does this all mean? Is there anything else? Like, I wanna... Please. Don't make me miss anything. It's definitely weird coming back up here after a whole year. Yeah, I swear the moment I got here, it just all came flooding back. Here goes fast. I mean, we've seen that as um whatever her name is, I forgot. I don't think yeah. I don't think that's gonna add her what is her name? Sam. <laughs> I don't know how he keeps it all together. I, I'd be around. 
work. Well, we're all just gonna have to keep an eye on him. He must be going through so much, and he seems like, hey, that's weird. The door's locked. Yeah. Oh, uh, the dialogue just kind of stopped. To keep to keep people out. He said that. What people? I I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. That is kind of creepy, yeah. I am so scared. Uh... Why is he locking us in here, though? Like, please. What if we want to get out? What if we need to get out? Oh, no. Did everyone get a key then, or are they the last to arrive? Because he locked it again. <laughs> Oh. Oh, it's still Chris. Okay. Closer. Guess we gotta wait. I'm trying to get the appeal of killing time at the shooting range. How long is this gonna take? Don't say killing time. Yeah. So beautiful today, but it might just feel too menacing, like sleeping giant. You gonna publish? What? Your pretty poem. The sleeping giant of Blackwood Forest. Oh shut up. What a crazy place to set up house. Hotel. Hotel and sanatorium. That's interesting. Cameras. Wonder if we're going to see anything. How long do I wait? <laughs> For the camera to change. Ghost orbs? Yes, this is phasmophobia. I thought the image was gonna change. Guess not. Okay. Um, it's the ring, Mel, please. Definitely had freezing temps. Not that. Okay, I hope I saw everything. Do not have seven days. Stop. I'm scared to even like take a sip because I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to miss anything. Okay. Just like going to the prom. Why am I scared? The right thing to do. Please don't fall. <laughs> Please. Hey, I'll get everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. My heart is pounding. I know, I've kind of been worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks. Bro, good talk. <laughs> Josh is a killer? Oh my you know god, Mel. Let's, let's just stop talking about what happened. Imagine. Uh, you know what, you're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Okay. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the my teacher god. Made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So, I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. Amazing. We became friends to this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early. And on Imagine, Saturday, oh my god. That shirt that showed off her training bra? I mean, who knows? You could be riding in Great a story, bro, bar. yeah. Right now. Thanks for the bitty mail. Some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. Oh, interesting. Okay, I see. I see where they were going with that story. Oh, I'm so on edge. Who's this? Jess. Mike's new girlfriend. Confident, trusting, irreverent. 
I think Jess was one of my favorites when I was watching a playthrough of this game. He's a killer... Chris? <laughs> Maybe it's Jess. Like, man, everyone be dying? No, I don't want that. Please. I don't want anyone to die. Please all stay alive. Please. Please. I don't know, though. I feel like I'm always bad at these games. I could play it again. What the hell? What the f- hey. Jessica, over here! Oh my god, uh, why? Are having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Can you please? I thought we were goners. Another ten minutes in there, and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look, got a lot of meat on my bones. <clears throat> this is all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. Hey! <laughs> well, 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 what do we have Chris. here? Chris! My goodness! Imagine being nah, not pushing that That's button, so yeah. crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I oh no. Chris is annoying as fuck. That's private. Give that back, you tool. tool yeah. Die. That's my motto. Oh, you're such an idiot. Well, you Mind might, Chris. You uh, might be the only one to die. Uh, oh no. Yeah, I, I try. The internet that. connection. <gasps> no. Totally keep secrets. Whatever. You'll figure it out eventually. The connection was right, lost for a second. Tired of all this Can I save? Uh, Does this auto can. save? I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? Uh, I mean, you know, whoever. Uh huh. Sam. If they're together, though, like, why is that such an issue? I mean. She's gonna die? No, she's not, Mel. I'm gonna keep everyone alive, okay? Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge like right where the cable car ends? Wait, isn't that Mike's ex? <laughs> not that. I thought that was in the game for a second. I was like, <laughs> sorry, what? Oh my god, I need to find better audio of that clip. Uh, yeah, Mike's ex. Okay, okay. what do I know her from? Her face is very familiar to me. Intelligent, resourceful, and persuasive. Okay, good. That's gotta be awkward, though. Like, Mike and his new girlfriend and his ex all in the same cabin together? Is that the actress from Parks and Rec? Maybe? I don't know. Maybe. I don't, I, I, I don't think I've ever... Oh, hi, Matt. Wait, wasn't he there a year ago? Motivated, ambitious, active. Okay. Emily's new boyfriend. The one who's together with Chris Pratt in the show. I don't think that's her. I don't think that's her. So that's her new boyfriend. I think he was there the year before, though. Wasn't he holding the camera when they were pulling the prank? No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Oh, yeah. You've only seen like one episode. Yeah, same. Wait, is there stuff here? I don't want to miss things, please. Probably not. <laughs> that by daylight map, yeah, it's Ormond's. I've been kind of tempted to recreate that by daylight maps in The Sims ever since that um, Doctor Clue on video, where they put. <gasps> Fuck! <Jesus>. Shit! <laughs> Thank you. 
Emily's ex, intelligent, driven, persuasive. Emily was also persuasive, I think, and intelligent. You guys. Michael. Really, really Jesus. Right, dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> As you should. Michael, you're a jerk. Cool. Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. <sighs> up in the woods, it's spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of My heart. The spirit of things, seriously. Oh, I wrong. see it now. It's the hair that was throwing me off. Them. Don't be like that. Like what? She has what lighter hair in a superstore. Like this. Michael. I'm just gonna lay it out, otherwise this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, this is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Matt. I hear you, man. I wanna I keep it. things I friendly, because I want them all to, like, wanna help each other okay. and stuff. All good. You guys gonna make out now? Oh my god, totally. We're <sighs> when I hear it now. in the voice now as well. Uh, no. Seriously, I'm gonna go check on the cable car back down the trip. Right. See you, man. See ya. Right, see ya. Okay, there's an update, a status update. Okay. Oh. Oh shit! His relationship with Emily went down. Charitable went up. Romantic went down slightly, I think. Honest, funny, and brave also went down slightly. Okay. Okay. Oh, crap. Interesting. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah, just all the bags. Uh, why? I need to go find Sam. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. That's really... Sure. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. <sighs> Fine. I don't want to fight. All right. Fine. He it's was carrying them anyway. Of course, at the rest of the way. But you owe me one. Excuse me? Well, then we're even, at least. I'll think about it. Just be careful. See you up there, sweetie. Did I know Thank Rami you. Malek appeared in one of the Twilight movies? Yes, I think, yeah. That does ring a bell. Status update again. She's gonna follow Mike? Yeah. So romantic went up. Relationship with Emily is back up. Okay, that's good. Honesty is going down, though. Funny and brave is also going down. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Matt. <laughs> I think that vaguely rings a bell, him being in Twilight. <sighs> okay. Who's this? <sighs> Ashley. Okay. Wait, Chris is also crushing on her. Academic, inquisitive, forthright. I think Chris has said he also has a crush on... Ashley. That's cute. Okay. What are we gonna see? Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. Crashly? Let's make it happen. Or kind of nar. To check the expiration date on their big breakup. Not oh! <laughs> Jesus! Hey, whoa! <laughs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Jeez you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real. Oh scare my you. gosh! Oh my gosh! Why are they doing this to each other? Man, I'm really sorry, Ash. Damn. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh. It... Let me check it out. Do I tell him? Do I tell him? You're so confused by all of the entanglements. You want me to tell him, Mel? I just... 
Honestly, I know, but I don't want to ruin, like, the mood of the... Yeah, then fights. I want them to... <laughs> Betrayal. I know. I want everyone to get along, though. Like, I don't want any of the relationships to go down too low. I feel like... Would she spare his feelings and be like, Oh, don't look through this, or... I feel like the take a look one is almost like revenge for mislead. Okay, I'm gonna do it. I'm so yeah, sorry. Kind of busted. It's not. It's not like really interesting. It's just he might what? look anyway. For real? I bet I could find like a cool bear chowing down on a box or something. Uh, I'm gonna insist. I'm so sorry, Matt. No, really, Matt, it's not worth This has an effect. Just oh god. It, so just no. No. All right. Uh, sure. Is the audio so. okay by the way for the for the um stream? Status update. Jessica. I'm gonna look at the status update though. Can I not switch? Damn it. Can I not switch between the characters? I can only look at them. I can move her face. Oh, okay. Okay, I can only look at them when I'm controlling them. Matt will remember this. Oh, no. Audio seems fine for you. Okay, good. So I can only check on their statuses when I'm playing as them. <gasps> Jesus! Oh, you did not just do that. Put your hands where I can see. We've got you surrounded. Oh, she seems so happy. But who am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? Uh. Why was there a snowball there? I don't know, when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> oh. Oh! <laughs> right in the face. Hey, you know that? <laughs> Where are you hiding, little chickadee? Jesus! Oh, no, no, no! Oh! <gasps> Fuck, that's hey. stressful! Art? Oh, this was the. <gasps> Hello, come on. <laughs> hey, Mike. This was one of the totems. <laughs> Don't know what that means, though. Something. Do sometimes doing nothing is the right thing to do. Okay. Oh, I see. Yeah, we're not doing that. Why would I hit the bird? That's really weird. The music, I know. Oh. Oh, this is so stressful. Uh, they're kind of cute, though. Oh, yeah. Oh, more. Oh, you're going down. Gotcha. Done. City. He did just chat Does to his ex, down? but uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think you'd know so if I did. Excuse right. you? My Jesus. Mind. So are we calling it my favor then? Your worthy opponent, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Did it? Look away. No, it, it really doesn't. Wow. Save some for later, buddy. Endless reserves. <gasps> Everyone, look away. Yeah. Cover your eyes. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I feel like grabbing I mean, the snowball wouldn't here. have been a positive option. I was out with you the whole time. Why did she tense up? What do you mean? Quote, unquote. 
Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Yeah. Okay. Status update. Why did honesty go down? He kissed her and she went stiff. Oh, I didn't know this that. I don't understand some of these. Why did honest and charitable go down? Because she hit him with all the snowballs, maybe charitable went down, but honest? I don't. I don't know. <laughs> some of these are going to be weird. Like, I feel like I'm not going to be able to predict all of these. Who's in there? I need to pee. It seems we're hard to scratch the surface in our last session, so let's go a little bit. I'm sweating as well. Maybe because she pretended to surrender but then threw a snowball, time, maybe. But I couldn't really. Try to understand the yeah, no, I could have chosen anxiety. something else. Now pick up that book, turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. Looks sake. I mean. Yes, Mel? When I told you to get therapy, yes. <laughs> this is not what you thought I meant. Listen. Ooh, both? I had pet rats. Rats don't really scare me. To be fair, I wanted a pet snake when I was younger as well, so... <laughs> Why is the hand gloved? Uh, I feel like... Snakes are probably scarier than cockroaches. Cockroaches are more gross than scary. Not the snake, what do you mean? Jesus fucking Christ. Um, I mean, that clown scares me. I'm not really scared of clowns in general, though. Unless they're creepy ones like that one. I guess in this, I don't know. Clowns, definitely clowns. In this image, yeah. Uh, the gloves, maybe, so that it doesn't give anything away about the gender of the character, maybe. Or like skin color or anything like that, yeah. Let me. Oh, Jesus. Did I startle you? So sorry. What kind of therapist are you? Real scarecrows aren't scary either, true. Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instinct, the more honest your answers will be, and the more <sighs> you will find this experience. Oh. I'm going through them quickly. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just trying to go as quickly as possible. Uh, I love dogs. That's also not a dog. That's a wolf. But... I don't like thunderstorms. This is very interesting. I'm actually pretty good with gore. Thank you. I don't... For 
answering so diligently. <laughs> oh, he grosses Sorry. me out. Zombie. No. Zombie. Ah. <laughs> Giving me Sounds chills. Amazing. Sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> you creep me out, sir. I don't like you. Please. Well, By the same image that. over and over, Once yeah. Again, we're out of time, but I promise. We'll They're really this. going in on the gore with that one. He scares me. What do you mean previously on? Is this in episodes? Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? It was just a prank, Han. Is he like Jason's mom and encourages the murder? Oh no. First off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back. Why does he sound drunk? Blackwood winter getaway. I really want to spend some quality time with you. Each and every one of you and um just share some moments that we'll never forget for, hi welcome in how are you doing for the sake of my sisters i need to go find sam whoa hello somebody's getting a little friendly so i got moved to the back and next to josh that's how we met boom butterfly effect. why am i on edge I feel like this mountain gets so it is in chapters. Climb, Nine hours until dawn. Feels the same to me. Josh, Hannah and Beth's bro brother, complex, thoughtful, loving. Okay. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. Wait, they actually they live there? I thought it was more like um, Funny you should say that. I vacation I home kind of thing. Jacket. Hey gang, you guys get up here okay? <sighs> Could have done with some bellboys, but uh, hey, <sighs> can't get everything. Yeah, it was pretty easy. A little creepy though. So we're all together now. It's really weird being back here. Sort of. Oh great. Yo yo yo, we get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. Um. Let's do that. Hey. We're gonna take a break right. soonish. Yeah, I know it must be really tough without your sister. Stop. I just meant that. No, I know what you meant. You know, seriously, Everyone is the killer. I want us to have a good time, you know? Maybe. <laughs> They're all just gonna kill each other. Damn it. It's a freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in, they're just all locked. There's gotta be like a window around the corner we can get like get open or something wait a second are you saying we should break in isn't this his house I don't think it's breaking in oh the place, right? <laughs> hey not if i don't report you um <laughs> lead the way coaches there's something off about josh hey ash hi chris so how are you doing? I think they know. Good, but <laughs> I think they know. Cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah, that does sound pretty nice. Okay. Oh, can I look at his um, relationships and stuff? Okay. Good. Um, pretty hot today, right? She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? Um, and I just want to rip that Parker right off of her and make some snow angels, right? Let's not hey. be disgusting human yeah, beings. I mean, I mean you're not gonna bang her. Maybe Michael take up the case. Wait, will you back off on Relax. Already? Just checking to see if there's some blood flowing down there. Yeah. 
Listen, dude. Look around you. Look at these That's beautiful disgusting. mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? Uh, you Josh? And Ashley, alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. Let's, I mean... I don't know, man. How can you not know? What if it's, like, weird? And what if she, she might, like, want to be friends with me anymore if I try something like that? I mean, weren't you just listening? You gotta buck up, bro. Grow up here. Interesting choice of words. Okay. So, how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? Um, Super Massive Games focus more on ambient? Yeah. Is there anything I can do here? Not a good way to get laid. Oh shoot, nobody likes cool buns. Before I go to the windows, I want to check everything. Damn, I'm getting pretty low on juice here. Um, I'm finally like outside. Okay, I can't go there. What? Why? It's pretty much all you talk about. Well, you know, I mean, all this stuff. Well, you got an app that can get us into the lodge? Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. Oh. Game claims these people are teenagers, making that Hannah scene highly sus. Yeah. They don't look like teenagers to me. They look more like... Um... College kids. But I guess they could be teenagers. Oh, I'm okay. Should have paid more attention in climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. Climbing class? Whoa. They're definitely college or pre-uni, pre yeah. I, I don't think so. Here, use this. Is he not coming in? This is your house. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. What, what is it? Okay, so I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that. With the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's it, how's it stick? And then gonna set the Spray place on fire? Oh, yeah. Now I gotcha. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the little army dude. Oh, so to unfreeze the lock. Melt. Okay, okay, okay. Put the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye bye, frozen lock. Okay, okay, okay. Bingo. Okay. All right, so you got this. I'm gonna go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Gods. Alrighty. This is not going to be a terrible idea at all. Why is he not going? This is your house. You know where everything is. Sus, it is. Like, surely you can find the spray. Lost totem. Oh, that was brown. Okay, okay. <sighs> okay. Oh, that's how you replay it. Okay, 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 okay. Interesting. Totems are premonitions of any scene. Yeah, I know. I know, I know. Okay. Still don't know why Josh isn't here. That's his name, right? Ex janitor. Ex janitor convicted for arson. Swears revenge on movie mogul's family. 
Victor Milgram. That's the wanted person. I, I think we saw like a wanted poster. Was yesterday sentenced to 16 years in prison for aggravated arson committed on Blackwood Pines. Milgram, Milgram was employed as a janitor of the mountain's old hotel for 28 years. However, when Hollywood producer Bob Washington acquired the property, Milgram was fired. In a sensational twist, the sentencing ended with an enraged Milgram screaming obscenities at Washington's heavily pregnant wife, Melinda, calling her an effing whore. He vowed to get all of you, your effing husband and kids, and said he would make them suffer. Melinda had visibly, visibly struggled to maintain her composure throughout the case and later claimed that though she was upset by Milgram's threats, she had full faith in the legal system to keep her and her family safe. Okay. Freddie Mercury? You mean Freddy Krueger? I'm so confused. So confused. What do you mean? What do you mean? Okay. Um... Anything else? No. Okay. I still don't understand why he's sending us. Wasn't Freddy Krueger a janitor that set a school on fire? Oh, was he? Huh? That's cool. Oh, that's... Why is that a clue? Oh, oh no, I missed things already. A uh, portrait of the Washington family. Hannah is wearing a distinctive locket. Interesting. Okay. I'm sorry. What? Why was that door moving? I'm so sorry, but why? Oh my god, okay. Um... So he can go murder someone or me? Please. Wait, can I not? Is there whispering? I hear whispering. Who's whispering? Okay, I can't actually go that way. Um. I mean, I can't open the door yet. I know that. Okay. Maybe I should have tried. Maybe that'll unlock some sort of possibility. I don't know why it would, but it could. Of course. Hi, Chris. Very funny. Oh, how'd you know it was me? Shouldn't you be, like, getting the lock open or something? Yeah. On it. Okay. I think I might do that and then take a break. What are all these sounds? Like, what the fuck is happening? Okay. Oh. Okay. Didn't really do anything. Okay. This place is huge.
Oh, can I... Can I light these candles? Oh. Okay. Interesting. Oh. One new message. New message. Hi, Mrs. Washington. This is Sergeant Tate again. It's bad news, I'm afraid. Yeah, we've been through the case files, and there's nothing we can do. He's a free man. We don't have the legal power to restrict his movement. Uh, I know it's not what you wanted to hear, so call me if you. Okay, so the guy me. got out. Then. End of messages. Okay. Okay, so we found the three clues. Sounds like a warning. And it's so weird that they're all scaring each other and pulling pranks on each other when it was a prank that killed two of their friends right there only a year ago, right? I know. They're still assholes, I, I guess. Okay, okay. I'm gonna just look at everything here. Prom night photo. Ready for the senior prom. Hannah, Sam, Mike, and Emily. Okay. Okay. That's something. No. I love how he's just letting everyone freeze <laughs> while I'm exploring. He's just like, yeah, this is fine. Okay. What is the constant whispering? I'm. Very scared. Okay. Oh, can I close that? No. I can't believe I already missed two clues or three clues about the twins, though. I've been trying to really explore with every single scene and chapter um but apparently unless they don't necessarily appear in order but i would think so because the clues about the mystery man seem to have appeared in order so Not to be funny, but this kind of looks like a Sims plant. <laughs> um, like one of the... You wonder if you can collect every clue on a single playthrough. Oh, that's a good question, actually. Maybe not. Maybe it depends on choices made. Oh, that would make sense. Is this a bathroom? What the hell is that rattling? Uh, is it not sus that it's old boy's house and he doesn't have keys? I think he has keys. I think the lock is frozen. So they can't actually use the key. Sorry. Yeah, that is weird. I don't really know why he's not... <laughs> Jesus Christ! Shut the fuck! Ah. <sighs> ah, perfect. Oh my God. Poor 
freezing our buns off out here. And if the home is abandoned with wild animals in it, yeah, that is also a little weird. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll, I'll be here all week. Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> Crap, that thing freaked me out. What was it? Are you okay? Is, like is it just you or is that a really big can? Of no, that's... You can get big cans like that. Baby, don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. Okay, where's the Sweet rest home. of them? Sweet is not the word I use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. How did the boar so the boar? That's not a boar. This place barely looks any different. Yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? There were windows open to be fair. Up here lately. Nope. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Hey. Hey man. Make yourself at home, bro. We'll do. Why are they not turning on any of the lights? Butterfly effect update. Oh. Chris was happy to see Sam. Yeah, hello? Hello? Uh, Chris continued to trust Sam. Oh. Is that it? Okay. Notice as you play other games that have houses or maps in, I tend to also think or say, sh <laughs> yeah, should I build this house in The Sims? Yeah, Sims on the brain. Yeah, exactly. I do it with um, TV shows and movies as well. I'm like, oh, should I try to build this house in The Sims? <laughs> uh, Ashley discouraged Matt from using the telescope. Matt didn't see Mike and Emily flirting. Were they flirting though? Like, do we really know? Matt was relaxed when Mike and Jessica arrived at the lodge. See, I feel like he would have probably been a little antagonizing if he had seen that. Maybe. Oh my god, that is so gross. <laughs> Are you trying to swallow his face whole? Yeah. Were they even Seriously, doing anything? Be any more obvious? No one wants in on your territory, honey. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did oh no. You not hear me with your sluttiness too loud. Sounds like someone's bitter she didn't make the cut. Yeah, it's all a big cattle call with that dream boat. Congrats, you're top cow. Oh That's my god. Homecoming a cow. Em, come on. No, shut up, Matt. Stay out of it, you dumb oaf. Hey, watch it. Oh, you're Jesus. Put him down. No one else can play with your toys. You're such a bitch. Whatever. I'm pretty sure the bitch is you, you but think. at least I can think. 4.0 bitch. On a roll. Suck on that when you're trying to sleep your way into a job. Who needs grades when you've got all the natural advantages you can handle? Oh, please. You can damn thread with your skanky ass. <laughs> Are you serious? You think that's insulting? That bitch is on crack or something. Emily, stop. That's not going to be good for their relationship. There's no reason to fight like this. Yeah, Em. Why are you picking fights over your ex-boyfriend, huh? Stop it! This is not why we came up Why does she it's care if she has a new partner? Exactly. That's not what I wanted. If we can't get along for ten minutes, and maybe we need a little bit of a break, right? Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, all right. Why did a Mike say anything? Place without that whore. It's right up the trail. Jesus. The way you taught yourself to do roofs in Sims 3 and 4 was to notice how the way roofs were in real life. I feel like that's a good way to do it, yeah. So, Josh, uh, should we get the spot? The yeah, others are just standing there in the bag? background. Huh? My bag, the, the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you, are you listening? Oh my god, don't you remember next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she was Sheesh. asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. Oh my god, Em. You they have a great relationship, I can tell. I you forget my bag. Well, do I... you? I love how the others are awkwardly just standing around like, um. 
Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. Why are they splitting up? Please. We can get very warm. Okay. Please. Okay. You feel bad for him? Yeah. It definitely feels like she's just using him. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. Is that really a good idea? In this house? <sighs> Exiled. Status update. Okay. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Nothing Exiled. for him. <laughs> Works for me. Oh, bar. How far is this cabin anyway? This cabin is the coziest most romantic love den you will ever Has he been remember. there before? <laughs> if we ever make it. I have a feeling Don't we'll joke about something. that. Play your cards right and maybe you will get lucky. Hey porn stars. You're going to need these. Porn star? I'd pay to see it. Uh gross. Oh now, god. Yeah, like that. Don't worry, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mhm. Mm Are they not going to be a part of the group at all? <laughs> I almost forgot. Got to fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right. Is this that by daylight? I think Josh was flirting with me. Okay. You want to invite him up with us? Wait, really? What? No. <laughs> Not the generator. I know. Okay. Let's go. Where is the generator? Hey, hot lips. Photo booth? All right, read my mind. Okay. Hey, please. Did you look at the camera? Oh my god. <laughs> this is perfect. We're like the cutest couple. Damn. You should be a model. You keep that camera handy and maybe I'll let you start my portfolio at the cabin. Oh my god, please. Wait. Noted. They're so cringy as well in their flirting. All of the characters. But... Like, why would you say wink out loud? So weird. <gasps> out here. Well, that's something I can help you with. And how are you gonna do that? Uh, I got a few things in mind. Am I missing things here? Were we not supposed to go to the generator? Is that what we're doing or? Emily's as dumb as she looks if she thinks she can cut in on what we got going Okay, on. that I came out of nowhere. Follow us out here and get Eaten by a bear. I think you bring out the worst there. Is that so? Epic jealousy. Suck it. Okay. Okay. We're no longer charitable. <laughs> okay. Oh? Oh, is this where the generator is? A totem. A brown one? Okay! Thanks for the host, Mel. say there's a killer probably great that's great that was ashley okay also are they not freaked out by All these right. totems let's see you knew it yeah oh 
Boom. Nice one, Mikey. Woo, you are a wizard. That window scares me. Fuck's sake, I knew it! I knew it! Why is it a roach totem? What do you mean? Oh, I see. Is that doctor? Stop! Surprise, we're playing Dead by Daylight. <laughs> Yeah, I was saying, I know, I was like, that window is suspicious behind him. <laughs> Had a roach carved on, yeah, I saw. I didn't notice at first. I'm more focused on, like, turning and inspecting them. Killer shack? No. The window scares me, yeah. The gates shall open. I'm just so on edge and I'm on high alert right? for everything that's a little bit suspicious. Um Okay, can I do anything here? You psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. I am so psyched right now. <laughs> it's like a little adventure. Oh my god, please. I'm scared. What is that? Not that. Jeez. Well, they never close the investigation. Getting the creeps now. Now? Well, whoever they are, I'm sure they're happy we're all thinking about them. Killer Shack Jim? Oh my god. Status update. Oh, we're like fully. Is that good or bad? Why did that turn red? I feel like red is not a good color. Maybe the high relationship is like gonna cloud our judgment in some cases or something. Fucking shit. Did you hear that? I heard something. Yeah. Arr, no. Dang. I don't think we can get up to the cabin with a path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, aka wax museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily. You know what? Fuck it. Why are they here? We will find another way around. If they're not gonna be hanging out. Yes! Jesus, with the rest of them. Hey, Jessica! Yep! Hey! I'm okay! Holy crap, you scared the heck out of me. How do you think I felt? Uh, you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> Amazing. Uh, yeah. Did you get out? I... I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. Uh... Alright, coming after you. Just stay put. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Hey, handsome. Oh my god. <sighs> okay. Wanna help me move this cart thing? We're fine. Butterfly effect update. Okay. I came to Jessica's aid immediately. Jessica appreciated Mike's heroism. Okay, I don't know if that was the right thing to do, though. Now we're both down here. <laughs> At least they're not separated. Right. I guess. Um, I'm moving, I'm moving. Oh. Uh, 
just grunting together. This is not what oh I Oh my god, please. <laughs> How are they gonna get out of this? Can I not? Oh. They won't, Mel, stop. They will. Ah! Uh. Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, oh holy uh. crap! Ugh. Oh Ugh. my god, are you okay? Uh, yep. Yeah. Yep, yeah, I'm fine. Please don't die. Please. I'm gonna feel so bad if someone dies. Oh my god, please. Comfort and reassurance. Where are we going? For the cabin buster. I saw something shiny here. What? What is this? Some kind of oh. shrine? Stogie. Weird place to hang. Some scars. Oh. That's crazy. Wonder who's out there. Um. There must be someone else up on the mountain. Yeah. No shit, we saw him. <laughs> what is this? Uh... This place is like historical. Holy bat cave. He's gotta be Native American, right? I don't think the miners were getting their arts and crafts on, no. <laughs> no, no, it's like a shrine or something. A shrine to what? Good question. Also a mystery man clue. Okay. I'm definitely not scared at all. This is totally fine and normal. The find in a mine. You alright? This is so dangerous. <laughs> Please get out of here. Yeah, it's just a normal vacation to a snowy mountain. It's fine. Okay. I could have also gone the other way. We can still do, I guess, but... Oh. Jesus. This place is a real fixer-upper. Okay. 1952 clue, the first one. A map showing structural faults in the mine marked up by a mine engineer. Looks like the owners knew there was a risk of collapse. Lovely. Please. The music is getting tense. Finally, a little ray of hope. Okay. Okay, they made it out. Lovely. I don't know if that is a good thing. Because this man was here. Where does this go? <sighs> okay. Get ready for a flash forward. I was gonna say flashback. Brown? Was that Ashley? I 
think that's Ashley. Okay. Okay, we're slowly piecing together. I'm gonna play the video. There is some gore in that. I'm gonna just quickly do that. Um, because this is an intense little clip. Sometime after the prospectors. Okay. And driven mad murderers. And many hunts. Okay. Does that kind of sound like the um therapist? We can't go anywhere else. Okay. Really, this is something. Oh, okay. Why is this cabin so far away from the main building? And why were they invited if they're not going to be with the rest of the friend group? They didn't even bring their suitcases to this place. They are the sacrifice. Oh, Mel, stop! I don't want anyone to die. I also didn't want anyone to die in Detroit, become human though, Ooh, and we all know how that worked out for me. What is she seeing? She faking that? She faking that? <sighs> Fuck. Did he not see that? Hello? Hey, Jess? Mm hmm. Stay close by. <sighs> What's that? Oh, uh, this posting says there's some brown bears up here sometimes. And what? Oh, Michael. I have the best idea. What? Let's go hug a bear. Oh my on, god, please. Jess, please. Uh, Northwestern Wolf. Hug a bear. Um, you'll be glad to know that wolf numbers are kept well. Okay. Grizzly bear, omnivore. Not, down, not known to turn down any meal. Though extremely dangerous, grizzly bear attacks on humans remain rare. Rocky Mountain Elk. Though they are often quite docile, the dominant males are known to aggressively defend their ha harem from any intruders, leading to brutal bouts of headbutting and charging. Okay, let's hope we don't run into any males, I guess. Oh, wait. Where did we come from? Okay, I guess... Wasn't the generator supposed to help us with the light? It's still pretty dark. What was that tense music? <laughs> Jesus! Watch out, bird brain. <sighs> I was just... Just answering his mating call. Wow, you're easy. Yeah. Got a lot of love to give. <laughs> oh my god. Status update. Okay. 
at least we're funny, I guess. He missed a skill check. Please. Okay, that seems dangerous. A river? Yeah, and the bridge is kind of scuffed. Uh, okay. Cabin, okay, is this something? Oh. God damn it, Josh. Couldn't you have at least cleared out the path before sending us up here? Yeah, this is all very odd. What? I didn't figure you for the glass half empty type. You got a better idea? Stand back, Debbie Downer. Oh, boo! Show off. Hey, Mike. You've got something on your face. <laughs> Where's the bear? Hopefully okay. nowhere. Okay. Well, that's how it's gonna be. Jess? <laughs> Jess! Lovely. That's great. Why are they not turning on the lights? Uh, well, I was just getting into the bath. Oh. Oh, do you need any help with that? He's Party gross. Are. Come on. All right, Josh, let's see if you know how to hook up the hot water in your big fancy lodge. Okay. There's something here. Oh, that's something. Okay. Does he know how to hook up the electricity? What was that? Okay. I want to explore more. Let's I don't want to know. Let's go. This is a nice cabin, though. <laughs> Very big. Because they are rich, so it makes sense. That's something? Something's stuck in my eye. I don't know what. It's annoying. You would think he would have prepared this if he invited everyone. Tattoo artist. Oh, that's the tattoo butterfly. The tattoo butterfly? The butterfly tattoo. Um, that Hannah had. Yeah, yeah, she, she got that one. Hannah. Happy Christmas 2010, sis. Love, Josh. Okay. Oh, he loves his sister. Is there a gift? There was something else, right? <clears throat> Hello? Oh no, that's just that. Okay, never mind. 
Right, I thought there was maybe something else. Party. Dear Hannah, I would be delighted if you could attend my awesome party. Location of Casa de Mike, my house. RSVP. Okay. Maybe we knew that. Oh. Hmm. What is that? Hello. Could this be any more about Mike? Mike and Hannah. OCC, this is not going to work. He's like a crazy, reckless hunk of a man. And you're staying at home working on your embroidery and practicing G minor on the piano. Give up on it. Or do something really wild. Run away from home or get a tattoo or something. Anything to attract his precious attention. I mean, it's for love, right? So just do it. So that's why she got the tattoo, I'm assuming. Never listen to these trashy teen magazine quizzes, though. A screwed up magazine magazine quiz. It looks like Hannah wasn't happy with the answer she got. It's an indication of her emotional state on the night of the twins' disappearance. Okay. I remember th taking those quizzes, though, <laughs> in the teen magazines. And then being disappointed by the answer as if it was anything real. <laughs> Anna, Josh, Josh, and Beth, you are invited to Sam's Halloween party. Fancy dress oblique. Oh. Um. That was one of the cards shown. Like, the therapist showed us this card. Okay. That's weird and creepy as fuck, but okay. Oh my god, my eye. It's annoying me. Anything here? I think I looked at everything. Probably. Anything about these masks or something? They seem so prominent, I feel like it's a clue. I got an idea for you two. Awkward silence. <laughs> oh, thanks for the host, man. I appreciate it. Interesting, there is a locked door. They're just standing there. All awkward. Okay. Oh, can I not? Okay, I can. Come on. What is that? Winner. Best horror film. Please. Which 
Josh's dad directed. Okay. Okay. Well, I'm pretty sure that somewhere in this crazy place. No. Those things are a joke, man. They don't do shit. No way, bro. I mean, we used to do it all the time, me and... Well... Josh, you know hot water's kind of major oversight, don't you think? Yeah. Yeah, you just gotta fire up the boiler. It's in the basement. Why is he not taking care of all this stuff? Like, if you invite people, surely you would have this all in order. Um... Okay. Guess so. Brad. I doubt that. God, please. Let's see if there's anything I can look at first. Maybe not. I feel like there's an eyelash in my eye. He's the pawn? What do you mean, Mel? No one is going to be in danger. Bringing them all there to be murdered? No. We'll, we'll be fine. You know what, Josh? I want to explore. <laughs> I want to see if I can find more clues. Why am I stuck? Oh, I can't. Okay. I can't. guess we're going down to the basement as revenge for the sisters, you think? They didn't really do anything, though. Wasn't he asleep when that happened? I feel like he was asleep. Surely he wouldn't know. Oh, hello, I can see something there. I can see. I can see it listening. Please. Played a prank. I know, but it was he wasn't even there for that, was he? Locked. Okay. You know, but his sisters died. That's true. Unless they told him, I guess, but I don't know why they would. We, oh, we saw that. Yeah, we saw that. Okay. Never mind then, I guess. These camera angles are something else. And I say this with every PlayStation game I play. how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together. Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. Why are you so obsessed with they are very couples? I wish they'd just freaking get on with it already. I swear, they just need, like, something to bond over. You know, some sort of traumatic event to send them into each other's arms. Uh -oh. I mean, at this rate, they'll be in the geriatric ward before Chris makes a move. <laughs> That's weird. Why would you say that? <laughs> Josh with his lovely sisters, Hannah, Beth. Looking great, guys. Who... Excuse me. Who posted up there? Or left up there? See? Oh my god. Well, you might be right. <laughs> like him. He creeps me out, actually. You know, Sam. Yes, Josh? I just wanted to say... Uh, what? 
it really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year and you know that you came, Sam. Josh, we're here for you. Really, whatever you need, whenever, we're all gonna make it through this. Together. Um, I hope so. I'm gonna try my best. Time, you know? I'm gonna try my best, Sam. I promise. We're in the basement. Hey, step. I think I can handle a little old set of stairs. Mm -hmm. Mean. What do you mean, watch your step? Basement hook time? No. Sorry to drag you down into the bow. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know? Why not? Well, it's definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. It's getting a hatchet? Please, Mel. Oh. She's getting a bat. Steve, is that you? Rough playing baseball out in all that snow. No, it wasn't in the winter, silly. I mean, we'd come up in the summer and we would have the best time. The whole family was there. Why did Mom, you give that to him? Dad, my sisters, it was some serious competition out there on the big lawn. I don't know. Don't be giving him weapons, please. Reality, right, Sam? Anyway, I'm supposed to be fixing this whole why does he always sound drunk? I don't know. There was a butterfly effect update. Something for later. Sam found a baseball bat and left it in the cellar. Okay. That's good. The body lightweight speaks to you? What do you mean? What do you mean, Mel? Melly? Hold this. What was that? What was what? Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing. The TikTok song? Oh. Hey. Oh fuck. Keep the light I wasn't moving, light. I swear. Okay. First things first, we gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Mm, sounds kinda complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. Imagine if I miss that. Should I do that? I don't feel like that's safe, maybe. I was not scared. No, no, you just jumped because you wanted to squeeze in some aerobics. Exactly. Oh my god. You were totally freaked out too. What? <laughs> You're no. as white as a sheet. No, no, come on. I've been 
I've been down here enough. This place makes all kinds of sound. Big old lodge has got to belch out sometimes. Why is that so weird? Why is everything so weird? And he's here, so he's not doing this. The rest of it is like weirdly regular. Not, not, nothing regular about it. I'm not sending her alone. or some problem with the furnace. Unlikely. If it were me, I wouldn't want this place to burn down in my watch. Yeah, right. You're better off though, maybe. Her bravery went down a lot. Josh doesn't like her as much anymore. Oh no. Arnar. What did I do that made him dislike us? <gasps> Jesus Christ! I missed it! 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 No! Why is this locked? Come on! Why are these doors locked? To keep out strangers! Hey. Hey! What the hell? Oh, you just got mumped. What? <laughs> nice, nice one. That was good. Wait, but why would you do that? There's all this cool old movie crap down here. What was I? Was I not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you? Are you serious? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor. Joke master. Well, I, I said. Why are her. all I the doors friend, locked? Which was dumb. Holy crap! You were scared. Admit it. I was not. Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh. <sighs> Turn on the lights what at least. What name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're gonna take a vow of silence. Okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? <sighs> Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. You know what? You know what? No, no. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Mm. All right? So have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, hey. Josh. He has the key. Okay. All right. Okay. What is that on his desk? This place seems a little run down. I would like to understand your feelings toward people of fear. Why is he in the creep house? Is he? I would assume this would be the sanatorium. I was not pay what did he say? Not the spider on the desk. What did he say? I don't... I don't remember. Surely that's not his office? Why is he in some junkyard? It looks like it could be an office. But it definitely looks... Like it hasn't been used in a while. <laughs> You don't know you were watching the screen. Okay, I'm gonna. I don't know. How do you feel about people who are afraid? The windows are bored. I know. I think. Well, Mike has a fear of isolation. Do you feel pity for it? Okay, but Mike. He's mentioning Mike, so this can't be a flashback. <sighs> yeah, I know. This is not reflect Are we the killer? 
Like, is the player the killer? I don't know. I don't know. And now, let us investigate your feelings toward other people. In oh, no. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. How old would the crazy guy be? I don't know. Is he the crazy? Oh, maybe. Uh. So you would tell the truth, even if it resulted in an unpleasant outcome for your friend. And what about honesty then and charity? Yeah, but that is honesty. Charity is overrated, I suppose. Better to be true to yourself than to help others in need, eh? I mean... Oh, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. It didn't look like this before, did it? It didn't look like it was abandoned in the first few? What if it reflects the increasingly unbalanced state of mind? Oh, maybe. I do think since, um, what is he doing with his mouth? Can you stop that? Since he's referencing like Mike and stuff, I don't think, oh jeez, that's creepy. I don't think it's in the past because Mike is now. Or it's in the present now, and that's how it shows the change. Maybe, but the therapist doesn't seem any older. So I don't know. Who referenced Mike? The therapist. Um, he asked... Um... Do you feel pity for someone who's scared? And I was like, yes. And I was like, but Mike is scared of being isolated. So do you feel sorry for him? Something along those lines. So he mentioned Mike. Uh, going off the whole Jason vibe, his mom never aged because she was a memory. Oh... That's interesting. Maybe the therapist is a memory. Whoever is in the chair could be all in their mind. Oh, yeah, maybe. Maybe the therapist isn't actually there. Whoever this is, he knows Mike. Yeah. Yeah, that's also true. Now we know that the person this is, I don't know... Definitely knows Mike. Knows their names. Or knows Mike's name, at least. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Could be Mike. Also means Mike isn't the killer. Unless he has multiple personalities. Or unless... Unless... Oh, I don't know. I don't know, unless what? I feel like we're just adding layers upon layers? I know, and we don't know if any of it is actually accurate. Okay. It was just a prank, Han. Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedies of Han right. and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're we're all still here together you know, thinking of them whoa hello somebody's getting a little friendly boom butterfly effect excuse me did you say something oh did you not hear me with your sluttiness stop it <laughs> Mike why don't you check out the guest cabin the one I told missing you. is this a family yeah. thing what do you mean did you hear that what in God's name are you wearing? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. Not that. Don't mess with that. 
That's how it's gonna be. <gasps> right, she disappeared. I forgot about that. Yes. They're all gonna murder their friends. Oh my god, imagine. With the spirit world, you must free your mind. Do you mess with that? No, no, no. Drop all inhibitions and generally give yourself over entirely to the will of others, sublimating your every desire to the whims of the spirit master, which is me. It doesn't say that. And all present <laughs> will remove their garments at my sole discretion. Chris, come on. This is oh my serious. god. <laughs> Why are they so disgusting? <laughs> oh, shush it. Let's try this. Yes, please. We're all murdering psychopaths. Okay, Let's hope not. Let's see what happens. Ashley, since you're a recent convert, why don't you be our medium for today? Okay. Sam. Okay. Uh, Have I never done a Ouija there? board? No. no. Pick up the phone. Spirit, spirit phone. Um, it reminds you of that escape room we did recently. Oh my god, a little. <clears throat> Give us a sign. Yeah, like a peace sign or a Guys, stop sign. If you're not gonna take this seriously. Okay, okay. Is anyone there? Wherever there is. They're interesting. <laughs> Wait a minute. Did you do that? I, didn't I don't think I'd ever do one. <laughs> H. I'm assuming you have, Mel. What's happening? Are you moving it? I swear, it's just moving. Oh shit. Help. How are we supposed to help? I don't know. What does it mean? We need to know who it is if we're supposed to help them. Um. Who are you? Did one in high school at a sleepover. Oh, See, that terrifies me. Goes. Okay, S. I. S. T. E. R. Sister. Sister? sister? Who's sister? Oh, come on. Is this for real? Shut up. Ask it whose sister. Josh, it's it's gotta be. Yeah. Okay. Well, which sister is it then? Ashley, ask who it is. Uh, Emma. Who are we speaking to? Hannah. Is that candle gonna go out? Was that you? Yes. Oh God. <laughs> this is messed up. Josh, are you I'm fine? Are you sure? Because we can stop. No, dude, this is scary. I want to hear what it says. I don't know where to start. Think about it. If this is actually Hannah, I mean, we can find out what happened that night. Josh, I can handle it. Okay. Send help. Oh, no, not um, the internet connection going. Let me think. Uh, you never did a Ouija board, but you played hide and seek in the forest at night? Normal stuff? Oh my god. That sounds terrifying. You did a prayer thing before entering the board because it's meant to ward off bad spirits. But you ended up with a cup that left the board and you're not supposed to break the connection? Oh no. But then you have to ask permission to leave the board because if not, they can stay in your realm. That's like Phasmo, right? Like you have to be like... You have to like close the connection or something? Does the internet internet connection count? Not that. Um. Hannah? We miss you. <clears throat> and we want to know what happened to you. Can you... Can you tell us? What happened? B? E? R? Uh oh. I don't like this. Betrayed. What does she mean? Oh, it, it's still going. Oh god. K I L L E D. No. Kill. We didn't kill them. It was just a prank. A Ash, calm, calm down, okay? Just we, we need to um, find out more. I'm sorry. I am guys, so guys, sorry. What, what do they mean? Ask them what, what happened. It's, it's, the, it's the only way to know. Ask them, Ash. Okay. Who killed you? Hannah, who was it? Oh my god. L? I? B? The library. Maybe there's something in the library e here? E? R? <clears throat> o? O? 
Proof. There, there's, there's proof. In the library. Oh, no. oh. Jesus. <coughs> Holy shit. Chris. You know what? No, this is bullshit. This isn't real. Josh, I don't know what's going on. Listen. I don't know. I don't know if you think messing with me is somehow going to help me deal with my grief or whatever, but this is not cool. Josh, no! You I'm wanted so to on edge. the spirit board! Hey, hey, calm down. It's, it's not actually. I don't need this right now, okay? You guys are full of it. Should we go after him? Ah, man. I, I mean, he'll be okay. Let's, let's just give him some time. I don't blame him. That was crazy. The pointer flew right off the table. I mean, if, if you were faking it, if you were doing one hour of a job. I wasn't faking anything. I think we should do what it says. We should look in the library. Should we? I don't know about that. Status update. Oh, right, but I missed it because we're a mic now. Right. Jess. Jess. Surely sh this is a prank. She's pranking him, right? Jessica. Right. Oh. Please tell me she's pranking him. Buddy, you in there? Scared. <clears throat> ah! <sighs> Christ! <sighs> you scared the blue out of my jeans. I have never heard that before. Oh my god, uh, knowing how obnoxious their pranks are. This is 100% a prank. Jess, where did you go? This is not funny. Imagine if this game is just one big prank. Like, nothing actually happens. It's all just jump scares and totally things from I these pranks. You when I find you. <laughs> Uh, oh! <laughs> oh my oh my God. No. <laughs> that was so good. Was it, oh Jess? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. You had to see this. Had to I'm not see seeing it. No, 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 no. You recorded that? <laughs> Look at your face. <laughs> I was scared, oh Jess. You can't just jump out at somebody. I'm in the middle of the woods. It's scary. Oh I'm sorry, I did I'm scare you. If we send that to anybody, <gasps> I'm what? gonna kill you. I didn't know you had such a cute little lady like scream like My oh. god. <laughs> Guess you never really know someone until you've scared the pants off of them. As far as I can tell, my pants are still on. Oh, is that so? Yeah. Looks like you have to try harder. A challenge, eh? Oh no. Up, you're strapped in cuz you're about to feel the Sorry, full what? Force of my mind melting thrill skills. Maybe Maybe you did see a shadow move behind her head. Can I make them all look at us? Yeah. It's like he's trying to think of something to say. He's like, um... Uh... <laughs> Is that a yellow one? <gasps> I missed one. Okay. Someone else is definitely here with them, though. Um. Wow. Kind of like a real winter wonderland out here now. Hey, girl, you know I'll help you up. What's that? Was it someone screaming? 
thing? No. No. Uh, probably just a squirrel. Freak town. Hey, what I really want to do is keep everyone alive, so please. What? Do you hear that? <clears throat> no. Hello! Yeah, just shout out in the woods, Mike. That's a great idea. Oh my god, please. You want to throw something? Oh my god, please, please. Oops. That thing almost killed us. Status update. When he's thinking about what to say, it's like, you're pretty, but your attitude stinks, not that. Not his charitable being all the way down in, in the red. Oh shit. Well, shit. Fuck. That's not good, probably. I am scared. Charming. It's everything you described, I mean... Michael. Wait, what? The cabin. I love it. Yeah. Wait. Can't be serious, right? This isn't it. Surely. I'm not gonna scare her. Oh my god, is she gonna scare him again? Hey, check out this mask. No, why? It's so weird, right? It creeps me out. I think you like it. Yeah, it's a creepy cabin. Uh, Don't call your I Shirley. Stop. Listen. You're lost. Is there anything else in there? Okay, so we found the mask. Um... Nineteen fifty-two, an old mining gap. Oh, was there like a um a mine incident in nineteen fifty-two? Is that what that is about? I don't. I still don't know what happened in fifty-two. But it might have something to do with the mines, I guess. Because there was that map with all of the weak points. Was there something here? Oh no, it's just a light. Okay. This is so unsettling. Get out of Killer Shack. Sometimes it's the safest place to be. Jeez. There are no pallets to drop? I know. I was just about to say, did something move there and I wanted to like move back? What the fuck? Please. Damn. It's horrible. Gee, I don't think he's gonna make it. Uh Put it out of its misery. Okay, bud. Hey. I'm gonna make this quick for you, okay? 
Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, okay. Uh, how do I... Uh, I can't watch this. Okay, okay. Look okay. away. Look away, everyone. Okay. Uh, 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 Wait, what, what did you do? What the fuck? It came up. Uh, how? Jesus. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Please, I need to keep them alive. Help her! Mike, what are you doing? I, don't know. I didn't do anything. I, I was using know. the wrong stick. I'm so sorry, actually. <laughs> I was using the left stick and I need to use the right one. Seriously? I just I'm sorry, Jess. I don't know. Mike, you're a big boy. You gotta think on your feet. Yeah, of course, Jess. I, I don't you know. need new pants? What? He was paralyzed in fear. Yeah. No, I'm sweating. No, no, no. Jesus. Don't turn out like that on me again, homeboy. Not attractive. Legend. Holy crap, I feel like I just ran a marathon. I think we kind of did. Was it a bear? Yeah, gotta be. Things are crazy fast. Don't look out the window, please. Hey, things not gonna come barging in, I promise. Hannah and sure. Beth are out to get you? Oh my goodness. Sure bears don't know how to open cabin doors. I've seen them open car doors. What? Where? On the internet. Really? He was her hero. This isn't the internet, Jess. Listen. Right, this is real life. I promise you that no bear or anything else is going to open that cabin door. I guess you're right. Okay. Bloody men. I'm almost feeling relaxed again. Almost. Huh. Typical. Arr. This is not the code. Butterfly effect update. Oh no. Um, Mike appreciate- uh, Jessica appreciated Mike's heroism. I continue to impress Jessica. Oh. What do you mean? He didn't save her. Don't make any promises you can't keep. Ooh, what do you mean? I was promised, Mike. Yeah, it's been three or something, right? Well, there is a fireplace. Well, we don't need a fire. If you need it done right, you have to rely on yourself. I am a lady, and a lady needs a proper romantic setting. Okay. A lady would like to cuddle up with her man by a nice cozy fire based mm. in atmospheric mood lighting. Right. It'll get plenty toasty once we're rubbing up against each other. Mike, please. Mike. Yeah. Fire and mood lighting. Yes. My lady. Mm. Mike, about nothing coming through that door. We need Steve, we do. I'm gonna check. Did I? Okay, I did see everything. Alright. He would be armed with that bat and ready. Make the cabin comfortable for Jessica. Okay. We would be gawking and get murdered. True. <laughs> We'd be distracted. Ah, this will take care of the mood lighting. Will it? All right, logs are ready to go. Just need a match. Native American myths and legends. Can I listen to uh listen? Can I listen to this book, please? Can I read this? What is this? Unless you want to make out with an ice sculpt, 
culture, I suggest you get a fire going. Oh, okay. Mother Bear returns. Um, Great Spirit sees all. Remember that and be wary. Respect is a way of the tribe. Looks like we weren't the only ones to meet the friendly neighborhood. Oh, that's bears. the symbol. That does not make me feel in the bear. cave, um, in the mines. Your symbols and signs scratched onto trees or daubed onto walls to communicate with other tribe members. Many symbols conveyed religious or mystical beliefs, others warned of danger or offered protection, and some told of good hunting grounds. Most symbols were specific to the tribe that used it and would be unrecognizable to other tribes. Okay, so the butterflies... A fire, Michael, not writing a novel. How much longer is it going to take you? Just please. Uh, the butterflies, a vision of... Or dream of the future. And that symbol that we saw in the mine was a ward or a spell protecting against evil spirits. Okay. Interesting. It's so cold in here right now, my tongue will get stuck to your flagpole. Oh, Jess. Not the flagpole. Yes. Jess, fire? please. Oh, way cool. After what they have just been through, rubbing up against each other would be the last thing on my mind. <laughs> yes, yeah, same. The only thing these teens have on their minds are Why pranks and sex. Listen. Right. Keep that gun, though, please. Never understand what we have together. So far, this is more mature audience than horror. True. I mean, their flirting is horrific, though, so... Oh. Uh, Lore, can we find matches? Hello, Mike, can you move? Shit. Fuck, Mike. What? Oh, crap. What? Where is it? What? What's wrong? Gone. It is gone, okay? Yes. She lose her Slow cell down. phone. What is gone? My freaking phone, Sherlock. Can you find it? Crap, no. Straight to DVD flirting. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. I can't lose my phone. My parents will kill me. You can always get a new one. That's like my fourth one this year. Okay, okay. What are you doing to your phones? Yeah, but can we find it's the matches? Yeah, I don't think. Fine. I think the matches are right there, Mike. Why is he Looks picking them up so delicately? Who's gonna fire up some nookie? You've been dying to use that line since you got here, haven't you? Man one, fire zero. Very sure. nice. Bravo. All right, my lady. They turned the generator on where, yeah, I don't know. Maybe it went out again? I think, well, I, I wish we had some booze. Uh, well, uh, if I'd have known that ahead of time. I don't know. I'm kind of just I'm not feeling it yet. Um, I love that he started a fire without getting wood. No, he did. He, I put the wood in before. No, 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 no. I mean, that was one of the first I things I did. I one way, but you're kind of another way. Does if that make sense? It's, it's not your fault. Uh, Jess? Huh? I really like you. Whoever you think I am, well, just give me a chance. And I will show you. Wood is not the problem here, Mel. Mike, the shutters. What about them? Um, close them, please. <laughs> oh, no. There's no one out there. I feel like someone's watching us. I don't like it. Yes, really. It's fine. 
One match to light a fire first time. Fire that hasn't been lit for a while. <laughs> Listen, it's fine. It's a magic fire status update. Why is this honesty going down? Don't understand. She's right, she is. Oh. I don't trust this, something is gonna jump out at us while we do this. Voila. Shutters are shutted. Serious black is gonna pop up in the fire, please. I'm sorry. <sighs> Sorry, I think I'm a little freaked out, and it's hard for me to like keep this up. And what? Keep, keep up. Look, I act all super confident and like a total sexy babe and everything, but underneath, I gotta be honest, I'm really kind of insecure. How long have they been together? I'm so confused. Jesus. You've gotta be. Nothing to be insecure about. Oh, <laughs> you have no idea. Sure, I do. He's just like me and everyone else. We're all insecure. But you know how to handle yourself. You might call it a front, but it's real. If it was that kind of magic, they would have lights. Yes, I do. <laughs> Lumos, exactly. And that's super fucking hot. Really? Yeah, hell yeah, it is. Come here. I'm scared. I handle you too. I am definitely ready to be handled. Oh my god, please. Butterfly effect update. Um Mike continued Jessica resisted Mike advances, okay? We're gonna need sensor bars? Yeah, just look away. What is this? A generator that they supposedly turned on? <gasps> Because it would be dark in the cabin. The cabin they are now in with no lights on. Maybe the generator went out. It's in the middle of nowhere. Go find out now, please. Don't send him out there on his own. Surely not. Are you gonna find anything else here? Also, hello, Mike. Um, can you walk towards the camera one more time? Am I gonna go outside with Mr. Freya? Listen, I just wouldn't send anyone out. What is that music? Oh, could I... Can I take the gun? I want the gun, please. Having second thoughts. Take the gun. I don't know if I can. This is why you need to go to the gym. Stop. I can't take the gun. Okay. That's totally safe and, and smart and stuff. Surely you take the gun. I can enjoy a bath in the dark? Oh my god. There's something here. Is that her phone? Did they throw her phone through the window, whoever it was? It's your phone! What? How is it my phone? Uh. No, Came through the window. Uh oh. Oh, for fuck's sake, god damn it. What? Those goddamn assholes probably followed us out here to fuck with us and just when we were getting down to business. Oh, 
No. Hey! Yeah! Chance. Hey, that means you! I know! <sighs> what are you trying to do? You want to ruin our fun that bad? Well, guess what? You can't! You can't ruin our good time! Because All right, Jess. Not her taunting the killer, I know. <gasps> no! <laughs> Not Jess. You really think the girls were communicating with us? I don't know if I wish they were or if I wish they weren't. I guess we should find out. Oh my god, you were literally about to say this is usually when they die. Have you never seen Scream? Don't have sex. Truly. Oh my god. Uh, wait, can I explore up here? No, not really. Okay. Never mind. Let's go, Chris. Josh looked really freaked out at the seance. Yeah, I mean, he, yeah he obviously. Like he it was together. a seance. You think we should have mentioned his sisters? I mean, it's why we came back up here. What the fuck uh, was that thing even? Like, yeah, that did not yeah, seem seance, like a person. Maybe we went too far. Unless maybe someone in like a costume or something? I don't know. Oh. Yeah. The power's not even on. Wait. Ha! Huh. Electricity is out, but there is an electric light shining from the room below the library. Only good gals and pals live. Heard. It was blight. Locked, okay. Why are there so many locked doors? Please. Holy crap! Are you okay? I think um, so. Look. What? There was something behind the books. What is that? Is it a button? Why would there be a button? That's a good question. Should I push it? That's what buttons were for, I guess. Is this some sort of haunted mansion? <laughs> Send help. Maybe she shouldn't have stood outside and taunted the killer. Maybe. Leave it to the Washingtons to have secret passages in their house? I mean, maybe they didn't even know. This place is super old. So, should we take a look? Yeah, after you. No, 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 no. You go. <sighs> Gee, thanks. Oh, uh, not the spider over the camera. Jesus. Who's scattering all these pictures around? Whoa, is what this... did you find? Oh. I will take them and bleed them like pigs and rip their soft white skin off. Fucking 16 years. 16 years I waited for pretty little Hannah and Beth. Holy cow. Let's be honest. Now, Ash, I, I, I don't want to freak you out, but... Look at this. What? Chris, what is that? I... I think this might be what the spirit board wanted us to find. <laughs> yeah, it's a letter. Let me see it. Thanks, Mel. It's a, a threat. Chris, 
This is serious. We need to find Josh right now. Can I go back in and see something else? Is that it? Okay. What is that mass? Oh. <laughs> Sorry, Ashley. You what now? The masks! What is up with all the masks? Oh, I'm scared. Do you think someone was actually after Hannah and Beth? Why are the lights out? That would be really messed up. Please. Is that... Dr. Swatham. Thank you for your response. It's good to know that the tribes still feel an attachment to the land here, even if we have a few unfortunate problems. Graffiti, people sleeping in the outbuildings. This is their ancestral home, after all. Uh, I've made contact with the descendants of the tribe and intend to make a donation to their elder council. Healing the wounds of the past won't be easy, but I feel it's a step that is necessary. Yours sincerely, Melinda Washington. Oh. Saw that crazy Looks guy like again. Josh's mom. Yeah, she's really making an effort to set things right with some native tribe or Hanging something. around the generator yep, shit. I'm going to start keeping a record. Okay. All clues to the mystery man. Oh, this was updated. Yeah, ward off evil spirits. Okay. Okay. I feel like I'm missing a lot of totems and stuff. Alright. Another locked door. Surprise, surprise. So, um, I've just been thinking about something I saw earlier with Sam. What? It, there was like this wanted poster, like full on Western style, you know? So? And Sam oh, no. really thought there was someone following her around. So, so what you're saying, there's some criminal up on the mountain with us? Hopefully there was a not. On this answering machine, I found, and it, it it was from this sergeant saying that there was this guy who had just got out of prison and there was nothing he could do. Well, what do you mean? He was saying it like, like a warning. I mean, maybe that's whoever was down in the basement before. What? Under the floorboards in the library. Oh, I was gonna say that was you. Light. You tried there to scare Sam and well, Josh. Wait, 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 what guy? The guy who threatened the Washingtons. I mean, he, he said he wanted to take revenge by burning the whole place down. And then I found that crazy psycho letter. Chris, if this is your way of trying to make me feel better, you're fired. You hear that? That was Josh! Coming from the kitchen. Josh! Josh! Coming! Hold on! Oh, for fuck's sake! Fuck.
Is he gonna cough on them now? Throw little vials? Yeah. Is that a balloon with an arrow on it? Eat their fingers? Oh my god! What? Okay. It's definitely changing. The office is definitely changing. Is that a coffin I'm behind going it? I'm show you some uh, pictures of people that you have come to know. I don't like all of them, but sure. He's like a puppeteer, he's so you creepy. Them as much as you pretend to. Well, this is an exercise oh, in no. Tell me which person from each pair you like the most. Take it to Oh the fuck. Party. Is this gonna de <sighs> is this gonna determine like who dies? Josh is creepy, I'm sorry. Butterfly effect, yeah. I'm so sorry, Emily. Oh no! Is this determining who is gonna die? <gasps> Wait! Oh no! Are they gonna target who I like more? Well, I don't know. I'm going to be honest. I'm just going to be honest. Because I don't know. It might be like... Ah, oh, this is tough. They're both pricks. But at least Mike is hot. <laughs> They might? Oh, maybe. I don't... I don't know. I also kind of want to keep Mike alive for Jess. Oh, what is this determining? Surely this is doing something. I'm sorry, but... Look, Chris is a prick. All the guys, except Matt, maybe, are pricks in this game. But Josh is a prick and creepy. But he did lose his sister, so... Josh, he gives you the creeps. Yeah, he's creepy and, like, a jerk. <laughs> also, interesting that they're all in there. So maybe it is an outsider and not someone in the group. I'm afraid. Once again, we're out of time. Don't be too hard on Joshua. What does that mean? Uh, I think Josh might be the clown. Interesting. Wait. We're gonna. So we can talk, you know? Could be subjective. As in, Josh hates himself. True. True. And also, I don't know who this character is. So maybe I, like, said I like myself. I don't know. <laughs> you think Josh might be the person sitting in the chair? 
Oh, so like this is the future. And Josh is older. Josh and Ashley, you mean? We're heard screaming from the kitchen. Oh, yeah, maybe. Look at the clues. A few months before they disappeared. See, but... It doesn't say anywhere that they died, even though I'm pretty sure they did die. It says disappeared everywhere. When the other guy ran in, Josh was nowhere to be seen. It was just Ashley and Cloud Guy. Oh, maybe. I didn't really pay attention to who was screaming. Uh, you've been convinced it's Josh from the start. He conveniently left Chris alone that time. There's so many things. Okay, but... Is Josh then also the one with um, Jess and Mike? I don't know, we'll see. Hold on! There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. Is this Robin Mel? Apparently he had warned them against pursuing their construction project in Blackwood Pines and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. From Stranger Things? S that voice? I... S T. Sister? Ask it whose sister? Josh, it's... it's gotta be! Which sister is it then? Ah! Ah! Oh! Oh! oh my god! Ash! Hey. I'm scared. Family of murderers? Maybe. Maybe I know how to handle you too. Maybe it was Josh in the clown mask screaming to get the others to come help him. Oh right, yeah, 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 because that's why they went looking, right? Seven hours until dawn. Oh, fuck, what the fuck? Mike. Jessica! Oh my god. Oh my god. Shit. Shit, shit, Jess! shit. Jessica! Surely Robin is too young. This game came out in 2015. Yeah. Does sound a lot like her, though. Something Josh said earlier when he sent two people off. It's amazing what happens when someone is traumatized. Why would you say that? That is weird. I missed it! Fuck! My hand was on the wrong button, ready. I was ready, I was expecting a different one. Surely he's gonna freeze to death now. Jessica! Jessica! Fuck. I need to pay attention here. <gasps> what? Don't shoot her! Jess! No! Uh. No! My heart is pounding. Please. Ah. 
I don't know. I'll catch up with Chad in a second. I need to. Uh, I need to focus here. Oh my god. One, one. Let's go, my boy. How does he know where they went though? Back down to the mines, I'm scared. Oh my god, Jesus fucking Christ. I am fucking sweating. <sighs> You're just wondering if it might be too obvious that it's Joss. Yeah, they're laying it on pretty thick, so I don't know. It's too obvious so that you steer away from Josh, maybe. I just wanted him to have a wet shirt. No, I genuinely... I had my finger on a different button as soon as I saw it pop up. I just clicked without thinking. <laughs> you think it's the twins as they are missing and not killed and no bodies were found. Ooh. Family has to be in on it together? Maybe. When they said they were missing before, you were like, hmm... Yeah, but you do believe Josh plays a part in it? Maybe, yeah. This is happening at the same time as the clown thing? There's at least two killers. I do think it's... We need to pay more attention to the timestamps, because it does give us, like, a timestamp when we switch to, um... Um... Different characters. I think Josh is the one with the therapist... Possibly. Oh my god, I am so scared. This is so stressful. This is so stressful. Okay. Okay, okay. We got this. We got this. We got this. Jessica, I'm coming! Oh! Oh, no, I'm that's coming. a... I thought that was just like, being pulled up, but it was like, a, it's a flag kind of thing. Torn up flag. Okay. Jessica! <sighs> A wolf. Guidance totem. Okay. I missed one. Don't like that. Okay. But Mike is gonna run into a wolf at some point. Or a dog. Why would you pet a wolf? Yeah, true. Oh, no! My God! Yes! For fun? Sure. Is that music? Don't mind me just exploring, Jess. I will come save you in a second. You don't pet wolves. No! Can't say I have. Oh, no, 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 no. She moved, she moved, she moved, I think. Thank god. Is she gonna fall? Is that elevator gonna fall down? Unless they're in a petting zoo? Yeah, there are experiences you can do with wolves, I think, where you can kind of pet them. I gotta say... Oh... Did I hit them? 
It was green, but I think I might have been too late, maybe. I didn't realize. I didn't. It didn't register what I had to do. I was like, why is there a timer sound? Uh. Quick. Please don't fall. Jump, 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 jump. Just about got that one. I got the wrong one. Feck. I press circle instead of square. Oh my god. Shit. Who is that? There he is. Save him. The numbers be dwindling. Oh my god. So I'm not supposed to hit that person, I'm guessing. I just gotta make it. He left the gun. Oh right, because the gun wasn't really working. Never mind. I'm terrified. Where have Matt and um, Emily been this whole time? <laughs> okay. Looking for her stupid bag somewhere. Honestly, they might be better off doing that. <laughs> Is that, like... is that the sanatorium? Was that the sanatorium with someone like walking there? Oh, what the... Oh. oh no. Oh. Ashley! Oh. So it's 20 to 1. Yeah, surely Josh can't be in two places at once. That blood. Not good. Not good at all. Okay. Okay. Looking for clues. They struggled here. Oh, shit. 
No. Okay. Ash! Why is the music getting so intense? Oh shit, no, that's your reaction? I know. I don't think I can go anywhere else. I'm trembling. Like, my hand is shaking. Which is not good because there are those, uh, don't move. Prompts. You'd be hazy not exploring for clues? Listen, Mel. We need to find clues so we have more options Ashley. to stay alive. Ashley? He got dragged off by some psycho. Oh, he doesn't know that because he was unconscious. Anyone Why did he Ashley? only grab Ashley? That's what I want to know. Why did he leave Chris? <gasps> what in the hell? I'm like, oh, you're bleeding out. Bleed slower. Wait, wait, wait. Those are twigs. Because she was close to the door. Oh, true. For fuck's sake, game, can you not, please? I know. What is that? The totem. Okay, good, 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 good. Not a black one. I've missed two? Oh my god. Big's head dumped on the mountain. It's fresh and there's blood splattered over it. It's fresh. Please. Oh. Hey. Wait, can I? No. Okay. Gotta go the other way, apparently. Jigsaw, where are you at? Truly. The therapist also mentions a game, and I, I thought he was talking about, like, me as the player playing a game. But it might be the killer, like, whoever it is. Kind of like Jigsaw, playing a game with people. Ash. Ash. 
flash. Yeah, this isn't scary at all. Not the killer shack again, I know. Scared. Wait, am I sure there's nothing there? I'm sorry. Was that Ashley? Cabin in the Woods vibes. There's a lot of horror tropes in this game. Yeah, I was gonna say that as well. And um, the dad in the family is like a horror movie director or producer or something. He won an award for a horror movie. Loss of a friend or of a head? Oh my god. A friend's head, I guess. Okay, before I head in, I need to hydrate. I can look at the clues. Oh, there's a new... Mike successfully chased after Jessica. Okay, good. Good, good. Um... Here it is. A film trophy. An award for a movie that Josh's dad directed. Best horror film. Interesting. Ashley! Uh, Ash, I'm here. Where are you? Uh, I don't know. Are you okay? Oh my god, what, what is this? Please, help me. Uh, I'm coming, Ash. Hey. Fuck. God damn it. Oh, Ashley, I need to explore. Oh, God, Chris, you have to get me out of here before he comes back! <gasps> what? Chris, There's a movie there? like this, and they have Hello. them in cages? And thank you all for joining oh, me. God, Tonight, what? we're gonna what conduct a little experiment. Oh, f Sort of test. Now, for this experiment, I don't know. I don't we'll need the cooperation of our two test subjects. Joshua and Ashley. What? Oh my god. But we're gonna need one more brave participant to help decide no. which subject will live <gasps> and which will die. It's giving jigsaw. It is, it is, it is, it is. Please, 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 everyone calm down. It's all very simple. Christopher. I'm stressed. You will find a lever placed directly in front of you. All you have to do is choose who you will see. Oh my god, no. Oh, no. Please, get me out. Oh, shit, shit, no. Oh, okay, okay. 
okay, 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 this is gonna be okay. Oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap. oh dude, buddy. Oh Let's just God. think about this for Griff, a minute. You can't let me die. Just give me a second. I, I, He's I, in I, love I, with I, Ashley, I, right? I Huh? Is he gonna pick the opposite? Oh! <gasps> okay, there's no timer, so we have time. What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? Maybe it isn't Josh? I know! Oh, right, and Josh is his best friend! Oh no! Who do we save? What do we do? And is it gonna do the opposite of what I choose? Like, if I say save Josh, is it then gonna save Ashley? Oh my god. Bros before hoes, hoes before bros. Look, Josh gives me very creepy vibes. I'm not gonna lie. Oh my god! Uh, what do I do? I don't know. I'm not gonna lie, my gut is telling me save Ashley, but... Shall I save Ashley? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Help me. What do you think? Who would you save? Poor Chris, I know. I say Ashley. Save Ashley. Gosh, it's creepy as fuck, yeah. Imagine taking like five minutes, ten minutes. He likes Ashley, you second saving Ashley. Um, when I picked in the book earlier, I said I dislike Josh, but also never picked Chris for any of them. You think this is a butterfly effect from that mini quiz, right? In reality, does he save his bestie over the girl? I don't know, I'm gonna go Ashley. I'm gonna go Ashley. Cause Josh, oh my god, and just, Josh is like the least, like the character I liked the least. And he's one of the options, oh my god. You prefer Ashley? I'm so sorry, Josh. Ashley, I'll get you out of this, I won't let you die. Oh, Thank you. Please, no. This is insane! This is not this isn't happening! Chris, please tell me this isn't happening! Oh no! I see. I don't know what to do! You chose to save, Ashley. I wasn't oh, sure no. if I had to, like, choose who to save or who to... Oh, Fred! Fred! Oh, Fred! Fred! Why would you do this? Turn away now, this is gonna be... I'm coming, Ash. I'm, I'm gonna get you down. I'm letting you down. Shh, that shh, is shh. awful. The blade on, is still on, going, though. Go. Be careful. Oh, my God. No! We gotta go, okay? <laughs> um. No. Chris! Ashley! Oh, there they are. Where have they been this whole time? Surely. But whose blood is that, Ash? Are you okay? Chris, Just, what happened? Josh, Josh, what, dude? You said Wait, not what? right in front of us, man. What are you talking the, the, the about? Maniac. Maniac. Oh my God, we gotta get out of here. He died thinking his best friend chose a girl over him. I know, Mel. So I'm, it was either him or I'm so sorry. Come right through, man. Spill it out, fucking everywhere. What? No, no, this is insane. We need to go get some help. Go right in hell. We're gonna figure this out. Matt, we need to go get help now. Chris, she's right. 
Right, who knows who'll be next, right? We just gotta go. Yeah, yeah, it's the only sane thing to do. We'll go get help. No, you just wanna save yourself. No, I just don't wanna make hasty decisions that get everyone killed. You can get everyone else together and I'll go get help. With Matt, right? Uh, okay. Or did he die? Family has all the props of a horror movie downstairs. It might be a trick. Oh, maybe. No hasty decisions. Oh my god, stop! Hello again. So far, everyone is still alive, I think. I mean, no, I didn't want Josh to die, so no. This is a vision of a very unstable mind. Um. That's not an answer to my question. It's not good for you. It's not good for anyone. And I can't say that you're being particularly honest in the way you're playing. <sighs> my God. Do you intend? Jeez. Don't know if he's real or not. I don't think he is. The heart of the problem, it all comes down to this. Can you really tell the difference anymore? Oh, Jesus. Okay. I doubt it. The way the background changes each, each time? Yeah, true. The way he's an epic creep. Now that can be real. The look on her face. All oh, right, Sam. What happened to Sam? A lot of things. None of them nice. What it? <laughs> she was taking a bath. Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. I've just been through enough spooking for one night. Okay, I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. So have fun. Josh F. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god! Shit! There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Oh, so it is that. Okay. There. Dread. Six hours until dawn. So it's 1 a.m. That's the wolf or dog. Wolf dog. Right. Let's get a closer look. The white one. Is that fire in the background or is that the reflection of the light? I think it's a reflection, okay. The wolves howling. What 
is this little building? Okay, can't get to it. Shit! What does that say? Oh, hello, Mike. Danger, keep out. Okay. Scared. Can I not? There's something there. Is that a white one? Fortune totem. That's the first good one we found. Okay. Should I try to reconstruct the video again? Does that mean Matt will be okay? Maybe. Everything depends. still depends on my choices, though. Like, this is just a possible outcome. Matt seems like the only decent dude. True. It doesn't show- m no, it doesn't. It's really confusing sometimes. <laughs> just- because sometimes it just shows- it shows, like, the outcome, but you don't know, like, the outcome of what. Like, what choice is gonna lead to that? I don't know. Okay... Condemned. Why wouldn't I end up in the creepiest place on planet Earth? It is deemed unlawful for any person to use or occupy this structure forthwith. 1954. Okay. Why is it getting more intense? Is he not freezing to death? Honestly. Their totem. What the fuck? The fuck was that? I've gotten all the lost ones so far. That was a mic? Was it? It looked like Mike did it. 
totem doesn't make sense. I loss of a friend. Is that Matt? Is that Matt falling down? Judging by the outfits. Look at his neck, like what he's wearing. I don't think the first whatever that is is Matt though. I think it's someone or something attacking Matt, potentially. Killing Matt. Really want to keep everyone alive, please. I say as everyone around me is dying. No one's dead yet, as far as we know. Oh, Josh is. <laughs> Not me forgetting about Josh. I was like, no, everyone's fine. And we just went through this horrific... <sighs> choice where Chris had to... You're pretty sure Jess is? She fell. She was alive when she fell. I'm gonna say, as long as we don't see a dead body like we did with Josh, they're probably not dead. Right? I already pushed it out of my mind. It was traumatizing. I had to... had to block it. Block it out. Is he not terrified? Please. <laughs> Running on adrenaline. Why is he canoodling with the wolves? There was something shiny here. Saw it in the background. Uh, the background? The background of the... Of the cutscene. Why is this Nemi's map? Surprise, this game is dead by daylight, everyone. <laughs> That's weird. Rescue of Miners. 1952. Be advised that the minor rescue is due to be completed tomorrow. As the number of surviving miners is unknown, prepare, prepare all beds in Ward A. Excuse me. The press, the press, <laughs> the press shall be in attendance tomorrow. We must be seen to be giving the miners the best possible care. Note that press visitors are not to be allowed into the psychiatric ward. Failure in this regard would reflect badly upon Mr. Bragg and the sanatorium as a whole. And shall result in this on the spot dismissal. You'll need a nose peg, those guys smell awful. Okay. 
who said that he would save Ashley. Oh, God. It's gonna have consequences somehow. I can tell. Everything has consequences. Every single choice. Clocking in minecarts. Okay. My neck is sore from just being tense the whole time. Broken camera. He's gonna have to give me a massage, please. Okay. Only a massage. <laughs> Mel, we're not in until dawn, it's fine. Don't need a reenactment of this game and Jess and Mike. Alar, trying to get him to walk here. I don't like the wolf noises, please. And the music is getting tense. Surely I'm not going down to the morgue. Are you kidding me? Can I just find this card, please? This key card? Huh. <sighs> reporter assaulted. A reporter from the Alberta Bugle was assaulted and hospitalized yesterday by security personnel at the Blackwood Sanatorium. Chuck Bernstein, a senior news reporter, was seeking an interview with the miners dramatically rescued on Tuesday. The men had been trapped underground for over three weeks after a structural collapse at the Northwest Mine in December and are now being treated at Blackwood Sanatorium for malnutrition and trauma. Jefferson Bragg, sole proprietor of both the Northwest Mining Company and the Blackwood Sanatorium, told the Bugle yesterday that the incident was unfortunate and that a full internal inquiry had been launched. He also claimed that Bernstein had been trespassing on sanatorium grounds without permission. It's believed that the assault arose from an argument about Bernstein's camera, which was confiscated immediately. Oh, so that's the broken camera. Okay. Why do I feel like we're getting closer to the wolves? 
Minor medical reports. Initial state of the 12 miners after the collapse of the mine and subsequent rescue at Blackwood Pines. On receipt of the 12 patients at the sanatorium's medical facility, we had fully expected to find emaciated shells of men, starved and confused. Thankfully, the miners appear cogent and relatively healthy, attributed to their apparent discovery of emergency food supplies in the mine. Inhibited respiratory function was detected in a few of the older men, as predicted, as well as symptoms of pneumonia. Psychologically, after being trapped for 23 days, the shock of reintegration has been difficult for some of the group. Though they're... Oh god, not me choking on my own spit. <laughs> Though their outward health is better than expected, they do seem affected by their time in the mine. Close off the A-wing. Psychological evaluations will take place as soon as possible. The men with respiratory problems have undergone a bronchoscopy and are prescribed a course of streptomycin. The others are simply kept under strict 24-hour observation. Okay. They were in there for three weeks. But not starving. Interesting. I don't want to go down to the morgue. Are you fucking kidding me? That seems like the worst idea right now. Like, seriously. Also, I don't want to be mauled to death by a wolf. Gonna pat it, it's fine. That depends on my choices, Mel. <laughs> okay, we have a weapon, that's good. Like, that's gonna come in handy at some point. Where are these wolves? That blood looks fresh, though. The like the watch, I guess. Does it not? That did not look like dried blood. Dance. Oh my god. Reply immediately. Reporters and other snoopers to be kept away at all costs. Oh, telegram. Hey, who wouldn't want press snooping around this paradise? Twelve survivors received at sanatorium showing signs of mental trauma may need to contain. Local press now have scent of blood becoming a problem. Please advise further. This is a ward. Oh my god. Please. Where is Jess? I just want to find Jess and get out. And leave. Why are they all still here? Fucking leave. I 
That's not creepy at all. Fucking choking. Scared. The wolf went that way, I think. Why don't we go here? We can. Oh, we can't. I can't crouch. Okay. Never mind. I'm gonna take a drink before there's another jump scare and I spill it all over myself. Your doctor has a skeleton in his office? Not that man. I mean, if anyone is gonna have it, it's gonna be a doctor. Oh my god, that rat scared me. Oh, how do I get there? Mike. Oh, that's the. Never mind, that's the chair. Okay, 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 okay. Serious? Who? What is that even? Uh... Whoa, whoa, whoa! Is this what he was feeding them? Oh. Oh no! No! <laughs> Feck. Feck, the wolves are coming. No, 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 no! Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh shit. Oh my god, is he gonna be eaten? Oh no, 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 I was- I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to choose that. What do I do? Off with the finger? Are you sure? Cut it off? I have to? Okay. Shit. Oh shit. Oh, I feel shit. like the stump oh, shit. Oh, shit. could have still oh, been used shit. to open oh, the bear shit. trap. Oh shit. Oh shit. No. We lost our weapon as well because it completely broke off. Because I tried to open it up. Luckily, there's like a medical kit. Yeah, we fucking lost the weapon! Fuck! We lost the weapon. We lost the weapon. Shit! I feel like the wolves are just meant to like stress you out more. Fuck! They didn't even come. Shit! We lost the weapon and our fingers. Just gets better. Jesus better. Christ. This is updated. Mentioned in the ca yeah, in the article. 
Oh, okay. Or unfortunate Mike, I know. I feel like I could have gotten him out if I had tried a third time. <sighs> but who knows, honestly. I do feel like we lost a weapon for no reason now, because I could have just cut them off instantly, and we would have still had the weapon. And now we lost both. I lost the fingers anyway, and I also lost the weapon, so I'm... Fuck, I'm annoyed. The fuck is that? Uh, you love how he's so calm with that. This place just keeps getting better and better after he just got cut off his finger. Yeah. Maybe that's the loss. Loss of fingers. Rip Mike's fingers. Think about it logically, though. The weapon would have would have broken with a bear trap, and it's a horror game. No. No, no, no. Thank you. Because we tried to grab a paper earlier, and that got us. That cost us our fingers. So no, no. Losing one finger is much better better than other outcomes. True. Registration of death. Your lacerations to the abdomen. Sarah Smith. Laceration by sharp implement? Possibly fingernails? Homicide. Body was not dis wait. Body was not discovered until six to eight hours after death. Sections of the intestine and kidneys were apparently eaten by the attacker. You would not be looking at these things. I'm scared. Wait, wait, wait. Wolves and tribes. Oh my god! I thought that moved. That's the key. Right, let's check this out. They're taming the wolves, or oh, maybe. I mean, it does seem like it. Oh, that's, that's the head. Off. Out. Too. Yeah, they're befriending the wolves, basically. Oh, fuck. Okay. I still feel like I made the wrong choice with that fucking machete. We could have used that probably in the future. I feel like I've just signed his death sentence by doing that. I mean, it's too late now. Nothing I can do about it, but... I feel like he could have used that at some point to save either himself or someone else. Hang on. I'm already thinking I might want to replay this game at some point. <gasps> Fuck! Jesus!
Where does the baseball bat come in? Is that for Sam? I think it's gonna be for Sam. Probably. Because she's the one that found it. But I don't know. There's a quaint little psycho crib. <sighs> okay. This is getting intense. There was a prompt. Wasn't there? Am I seeing things? Yeah, I might be seeing things. I thought there was one. Okay. No, that's where we were. Don't go back. Punch him. Easy boy. Easy. Easy. That's a good boy. Okay, new butterfly thingies. Mike hacked off his own fingers. Oh, Mike no longer had a usable machete after hacking off his fingers. And it's called At What Price? Oh my god. See, if I was going to hack his fingers off anyway, I should have done it, like, first go. He just charmed a wolf with his bare hands. <laughs> True. Oh, the wolf is there. Oh, can I pet you? You'd have chopped the finger off. Yeah, I should have done that. Yeah, good boy. Yeah. I know that now for next playthrough. Next minute, it takes his whole arm. <laughs> Imagine. Everyone likes a little loving, right? Oh, it was a good totem. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think. Yeah. See, now he has a friend. That's good. Now the wolf can protect him. Hopefully. Hopefully, that's what it means. My yeah. mouth is. Oh. You like that? We can pet him multiple yeah. times. My mouth is very dry. Girlfriend is dead. No, she's not, Mel. She's not. We're gonna save her. I got her. I got you, Jess. Wood jacket, that's good. He's missing a finger and he's taming the wolf. Oh. Not while I'm petting the wolf and wasting time. Stop. Well, we got a new weapon. Nice. 
Don't think the machete would have been handy. But at least we got something. Footprints found, local men found dead liars. 14 missing. Wait, 14? Note to self if in a horror scenario with me, peace out yourself. Could she be exploring like Dora? Listen. Bigfoot sighted. American. American something shed. Sighting, sighting. What does that say? Wait, 14. Were there only 12 miners? And it says 14 missing. Didn't they only find 12? Is this guy one of the miners? And is he like... You didn't look for me or whatever, like, is he angry? Although, 1950s, so surely. The twins. Oh. <gasps> That's the cigar we found. We found a cigar that had been smoked. I think it's the same type. Yeah, see? Found in the mine. Okay, okay, okay. You seriously think it has something to do with the twins? Yeah, maybe. Sightings and recent disappearances marked with dates. Looks like the work of an obsessive mind. Okay. It's looking like it, isn't it? Someone who is obsessed with the disappearance? Oh, that's for the wolves, probably. Maybe this will keep the wolves fat and happy. We got rid of Josh. Still sticking by the family theory. Yeah, Josh would probably be obsessed with the disappearance. Can I give this to the wolf? My buddy? Yeah, that's it. Mike, this is not yeah. a dog. He's getting very comfortable with that wolf. Maybe... Maybe stay a little bit wary. Mike. Give the wolf your fingertip? Not that. He can... No. <laughs> oh my god. I was gonna say he can give me a tip. But... Listen... It's fine. Why do I do these things to myself? Why do I say these things? I don't think there's anything else. Oh, that's a cigar thing. Is there anything else in there, or is it just the bones? You love that I said I'd finish this Friday? <laughs> I will. Doing 24 hours? No, no. I won't be streaming too much longer, I don't think. Maybe like an hour. We'll see how long this chapter is, and then we'll... I'll see. Here's a tip for me. Never put a light bulb in my back pocket. Imagine. Oh. 
Well, that's gonna be awfully loud. Sheesh. Okay. Or don't eat yellow snow. Not the yellow snow, please. There would be tons of yellow snow if I was here. <laughs> I'd have peed my pants a long time ago in this scenario. Miracle Men. Successful rescue of all 12 miners. See, it keeps saying 12 miners, but it said 14 disappeared. I feel like that's significant somehow. Either the twins or, like, I don't know. Did they miss people? Did they not find everyone? Wait. There were 30 miners trapped in the mine? Photograph only showed 12 survivors. 30? Okay, that's not even like half of them. That survived. Okay. That's even worse. That's a black one. Wait, who's dying? Oh, they're not in order either. Who is that? That's Mike. Who is that? Who is that person? Is that him? Don't use the lighter, I guess. Fuck, okay. Okay. Gas explosion? Yeah. Never mind the lighter. He's carrying a flame, true, but maybe he won't be in a later stage, I don't know. We don't know when this is gonna happen, like we have- it doesn't really give you any information, it just adds extra stress. <laughs> like honestly, I feel like I'd be perfectly fine playing this, not finding any totems, because I don't think the totems are really helpful in any way. The totems help with like to complete be a completionist. But um I don't really find them that helpful. Are we gonna shoot it again? Okay. That's so loud though. Anyone here is gonna know what we're doing. To be fair. Well, shit! Fuck. Fuck. A 
lot of this was dictated by the earlier decisions, maybe. Okay. I mean, so this can't be Josh. It's locked. The hell who did that? Then there's some seriously uncool shit going on up here tonight. Okay. Oh my god. Did we get a time for this? I I wasn't paying attention. I Josh is dead. Yeah, same. How he died. No, I, I mean, what if they were wrong? What? Maybe we should have checked the shed to see if it was really true. I, I don't know. There are some things that once you see them, you can never unsee them. That's true. Yeah, I guess, but some things you have to see for yourself. I'll take your word for it. Shall we do some exploring, Matt? We need to look at all of our options here. Let's take a quick little stroll through the snow. It's fine. That's two totems where we saw, I think, Matt die. Matt, it's not really looking good for you. I'm not gonna lie. something there Pain? Oh, wait thought that was blood at first okay so some of the blood might be fake interesting Interesting. Was it fake all along? The therapist did mention a game, like I said. But... Always has been. Interesting. Interesting. Look, an axe. Maybe a prank? Oh my god. Enough with the pranks. Wait, an axe? Where? Can I take that? Where is the axe? Did he not say look an axe? Not the axe? Oh. 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 Okay. At least keep it. These people need to stop pranking each other, honestly. Oh, now this is locked, Matt. We'll break the door down, will ya? Whoa, wait a second. We start smashing shit down. He's gonna hear us. Well, you got any better suggestions? I don't know. What about look? What? A window. That's great, Matt. I can just about fit my lip balm through that little slot. Oh, come on. You will never fit through there, big guy. I won't fit, but you will. Are you nuts? You're gonna shove my ass through that little hole? I've seen you slip into some pretty tight jeans, Em. Uh, excuse me? It's a talent. Think again, love oh, head. No can do. For one thing, that maniac is probably just sitting there under that window waiting to blend us into pina coladas. <sighs> okay, fine. Here it goes. No! Oh, then I'm gonna... Shh, just do it! That's too loud! No! I refuse. What if I don't do it? What if I just stand here? <sighs> We're gonna be here forever, right? Oh my god, please. Damn. What happened? This is crazy. 
We were here just a few hours ago. This must have just happened. What the fuck is going on? Die. Be the guy, the the one who who got to Chris and Ash and Josh. He's got to know this is the only way back. I don't say that. <sighs> Look, the cable car's all the way out there. Well, that's I, I mean that's not far, right? You you can jump it. Excuse you. I'm good, Em, but not that good. Flattered though. Matt, if you can't jump that, what are we gonna do? I, I don't know. God, everything is. Oh my God. Mike made a friend. Okay. That's good, I guess. All right. Like so busted up. I think they knew exactly what they were doing. Okay. They really did a number on this joint. Such a mess. This place was barely in working condition before, and now. Did they all forget about Sam? Just left her alone and haven't thought about her since? Yeah, she's just chilling in the bath, Mel. It's fine. She's just having the time of her life. Yeah, he does not be know what's going on. From all ears. Well, look at all this crap. There's gotta be something useful in here, hey, look, right? The fire tower. Hey, Magellan, maybe we should get the cable car working and take the show on the road, huh? She's being very rude. Very friendly. Oh, that's what the paint was used for. Okay. Um, where is the prompt? Hello? Hello? Oh. Please. Finally. Um. Oh, great. Yeah. No keys, no cable car. So back to square one. <gasps> what about the fire tower on on the map you found? What? I guess it's an option. Oh, maybe it has a radio or, or something. I mean, it it would, wouldn't it? Probably, yeah. Matt, we gotta get to that radio. Yeah. We can use the radio to call for help. But somebody's got to pick up the signal. He's on time. Wow, Matt. Good call. Radio. So smart. Why are you being so bitchy? Are, are you serious, serious well, Emily? Matt, easy. Can we break up with her? Because their relationship is really going down. Anything new or okay? She should have died, not Josh. Give her to the killer. If only I could feed her to the wolf. Jesus, Emily. Drop her. What if I just drop him here? Accidentally. You're right. Yeah. Uh, thanks. Maybe um you should go first to protect me. I don't know. 
he did a pretty good job protecting you okay. Okay, when you were in front, so... Okay. All right. Oh my gosh. Okay. Almost. Almost. I'm feeling kind of faint. Don't look down. Whoa. Okay. Okay. Holy cannoli, thank God that's over. Yeah, for real. My shoulders are so tense. Is that a totem? Okay, a yellow one? That's help, I think. Equality, you go first! Okay, what was that? Oh, guidance. I feel like I've missed so many. Is that a flare gun? Okay. I do wonder if the totems are like what unlocks certain choices. And like if you don't find a particular totem, you just won't. But okay, if it doesn't, we need a plan. Oh. This way. We can just climb down. Climb down what? The mountain. Are you serious? What's the big deal? It, it's not like it's floating in the sky. <laughs> it might as well be. It's pitch black out. Hey, hopefully we won't have to. You think the psychopath is just gonna give up and run away? No. But maybe we should find a safe spot. Hold up, wait it out. It, it'll be a little easier to figure this all out in the morning. I definitely expected that tree to fall down. Let's let's take some time to explore, Emily. Or not. Huh? Uh. That? Oh, a cell phone. <gasps> Beth's phone. Whoa, this is Beth's phone. I thought the police like swept the whole area. Well, it looks like they missed this. Okay. <gasps> is that the cliff where they died? Is that where we're heading now? Oh god. Okay, so that's Chris and Ashley. I think. I think this is where they fell. I think this is where Hannah and Beth fell. Watch where you step around here. Yes, Matt. Given the choice, I'd prefer not to spend my evening plugging into my desk off a snowy cliff top. Why the attitude? Like seriously. What the fuck? 
I was wondering what those cow sounds were. Ah! Uh... Not the peaceful music. That is a huge bath. Elks? Yeah, it sounded like cows, I'm not gonna lie. Dusty. Hello? That's a pool? It really is. Guys? What are you doing out there? No one's there, Bestie. You're by yourself. Well, <laughs> there's a killer in the house with okay. you. But... <sighs> She's literally living her best life, truly. This is one... Okay, this is all happening pretty... Pretty simultaneously, I think. My clothes, really? Whichever one of you oh. did this is off my Christmas list. Seriously, not cool, guys. Not cool at all. Who took her clothes? And why? Oh, no, I'm scared. Chris? Hold my hand, please. Josh? Not the balloon. Oh, no, no, no. The balloon is pointing that way, so no thank you! Oh, feck. Now she's on the run in a towel? I know. Go get the baseball bat real quick. I don't know if I can. Can I go down? Wait, where are the stairs? I don't think I can. Uh, okay. Well, I guess we're following the balloon. Really don't think we should. I'm terrified. <sighs> Why would that be chiming though? It was like Ten past one. Doesn't make sense. I'm I've been streaming for six hours. Listen. Chris, Vecna family. Vecna is coming. This is really getting out of hand, okay? It was all very funny. Haha. -ha. Look at Sam walking around in a towel, but now I just really want this to be over, alright? Okay. You had enough? This used to be my old... I used to stream six hours. Can I have my clothes back now or am I supposed to hang out in a towel for the rest of the weekend? Towel it is then. Vec not the Vecnussy likes the towel moment, apparently. You too, once upon a time. Yeah. I've been thinking about going back to longer streams again, but I'd need to figure it out with my schedule and stuff.
photo. Okay, if you were trying to freak me out, guess what? You don't know how you used to stream seven days? Yeah, I never did that. Who were you? <laughs> Fine. You can go back to that, Mel. Don't be shy. Just stream seven days for six hours. I'm just gonna guess this is still locked. Yeah. I'm gonna need a relaxing bath after this stream because I'm so tense. So you have here meat processing. Circular saw replacement blades. Okay. Does someone order that stuff? I mean we don't want to go out in this towel anyway, but you know. The masks are kind of freaking me out. Okay. Fuck. Jesus Christ. Raise your hand if you're going to have nightmares tonight. <laughs> I don't think I have any other options, unfortunately. You're so invested in this? Same. Same. I'm just glad I've been able to keep everyone but Josh, I guess, alive so far. <laughs> Not the bee. Oh, she is going to the basement, I think. Oh my god. Bye, Mel! No. Hey! Guys, come on! Oh, I'm done with this! I really don't appreciate the silent treatment here! Thanks for the shout-out? Of course! Not the basement. Yeah, the killer is taking us to the basement. Hello, Samantha. Looking for me? I don't think you'll have much luck by looking. He has the baseball home. bat. You're only going to see what I want you to see. And I have quite a lot to show you. What is going on? Open your eyes. Oh my god. She's quite beautiful, isn't she? What are you doing out there? A beautiful bathing bird. What? What Do you think she has any idea what lies ahead? Do you think these were the last happy moments of this creature's life? Showing this to me. Why are you watching? Josh! How does it make you feel? Oh my God, what did you this do? is fucked up, yes. I'm going to give you ten seconds. Nine. No, eight, no, 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 no! Seven. For what? Yay, murder, and please.
Oh fuck. My heart is pounding, my heart is pounding. Get the bat. Run. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? No handle? Apple. Oh no, 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 no. Fuck. Can we get the bat somewhere? Josh is behind the mask, do you think, man? Is that clown limping? I think it's because he's carrying whatever it is on one side. Where is the bat? Where is the bat? I'm scared, I'm scared, I'm scared. The circular saw thing was pretty convincing. was Stop! Shit. Shit Shit No that was exciting was it? <sighs> There was an entire rack of worth of bottle broken bottles and she reached yeah, for the plunger what plunger? I think she grabbed the knob for the oh, door. The good work. We did exploring the source of your fear. And you've just gone and used it for ill. Shit! Mm -hmm. I should have You're hidden. Oh well. Isolation. Fuck. You have turned it against these people who use it desperately want to torment. Has it been worth it? Are we gonna see? Oh. <gasps> Fuck! 